Alrighty, and we should now be live. What is up, everybody? Welcome back to the channel, and welcome to another episode of Grand Theft Auto San Andreas, the Definitive Edition, a rise to the top series. So we are back on this game today. We're going to be uh, starting off from our last save point, which is at Are You Going to San Fierro? So where we last left off story-wise, we had just unlocked San Fierro and just did a mission that brought us over here. I went around the map and gathered up all 50 of the different snapshot locations. So we now have some new weapons open up to us, uh, including sniper, SMG, shotgun, and of course grenades. So I'm gonna work on getting my weapon skills up, we're going to uh, do some more missions, and it's gonna be cool. So yeah, welcome to the stream, everybody. Welcome Steve, go home. Welcome Sam. Welcome Lily B, Alpha Nerd, Bob the Cacodemon. Good to see you guys. So hey, Cass, how's it going? Not too bad, Sam. Hope you're having a good one. Oh, huh, it's Cass Gaming. I expect you to be here. Yeah, I know, right? Stink. What am I doing here? No, I'm teasing. All right, so let's go ahead and start with our very first mission of the day, the mission the stream is appropriately named after, which is wear flowers in your hair. All right, here we go, boys. I don't know what to expect. Oh. Motherfucker! That mute asshole, that fucking snake without a tongue, gave me this shithole instead of a pink slip. I must be the biggest fucking idiot in the whole fucking world. Holmes, yeah. take it easy. At least we're alive. Girl, True. friend, fellow traveler, relax, man. You're really killing my fucking vibe here. Well, I'm sorry I'm fucking up your vibe, old wow. man, but I can't wait to get my hands on that mute and your bitch-ass cousin. My cousin? You're gonna diss my familia? Oh, bet. His eyes still my look bad, so squinty. Man. I'm just pissed for all of them. I mean, look, we in a strange place. We got shit to our name, and for once, I try to make something work this garage, and it ain't even a garage. Then make it into a garage. Oh... That's a great idea, sis. Won't you shut up? You know what, Carl? You are a fucking idiot. Your whole life you wanted something for nothing. Now you've got something and you don't know what to do with it. We'll make it good enough. We'll help, right? We got your back, CJ. Come on, stop tripping, man. Both of you. Whoa, man, the energy here is fantastic. Oh, <laughs> This guy's hilarious. Yeah, uh, all right. But how am I find some good mechanics to work up in here, man? I know a few guys. Come with me, friend. They're good people, I swear it. Oh, man, I'm about to ride with this fool again. <laughs> All right, Come guys. On, man. There's these two guys I know. Used to work on marine engines till the mob bought their business over in Vice. Now they try and make ends meet by taking any old job. They're a little bit dull by their habit, but the smoke don't get in the way of their skills with an engine. We'll pick up Jethro first. Last I heard, he was working at a garage over in East Basin. Sweet. Get inside the car. All right, guys, so we're going to go find a couple of mechanics to work in our garage with us that apparently were in Vice City once upon a time. That's funny. Uh, Alpha Nerd says, I'm currently beating GTA 5 for the first time. Congrats, man. I'm doing the final heist right now. Awesome. Did you enjoy it? Well, he says, how'd your appointment go? Went great. Thanks for asking. What is wrong with the color of CJ's neck compared to his face? I noticed that too. That was weird. It's fine now. No, it still looks weird. Why does it look so weird? I don't know. I don't know why that is. Hey, man, how you meet these dudes anyway? Met them at the 89 Pierre Lovin. I know, Rush. Here. You know how it is, man. Feel the tents, crazy ass music, a quart of mescaline vodka, polar bears. Polar bears? Yeah, go figure. They were funny guys, man. Great sense of humor. Huh. Well, okay then. Hey, at least they got a sense of humor. I guess that's what's important. This here's Vietnamese gang territory. Gang boys, shining razors, butterfly children. Watch yourself, dude. These cats are real serious. Oh, they're Vietnamese. Okay, I was speculating earlier whether they were like Chinese or Italian or what it is, but neither. They're Vietnamese. H to sound the car horn. Hey, Jethro. Come out front of the truck, dude. Hop in, man. I've landed you a real job. Hey there, Truth, dude. Oh, man. Do, do I owe you? Because I swear I paid for that weed, dude. No, man, we're good. I think. Jethro, <laughs> Carl. Carl, Jethro. What's up, man? Can we swing by the hospital? It's over in Santa Flora District. 
Wester here. Yeah. You sick? No. The government is. But that's a long story. So, you know, like, what's the deal, dudes? I'm opening the garage and door by the waste ground. You know, car mods, low rides, all that shit. Damn, some polar bear shit in the woods. Well, but they've been known to shit in the liquor tent. If I remember it right. Yeah, that was like Wow. So far gone. More music oh my out. gosh. Psycho Monkey says, hey, what's up, Psycho Monkey? Welcome to the stream, dude. Alpha Nerd says, yes, a lot. It's amazing. One of my favorite games. Awesome, man. I look forward to playing it. All right. Fun fact, San Andreas had an earthquake in 1988, which is based on the real-life earthquake. That was one month before the game started, which is why San Fierro looks destroyed in some areas. Oh, okay. Probably why they're doing all this construction on lots like this, too. That's good to know. By the way, if you're planning to also 100% GTA Online portion of GTA 5, be ready for a freaking challenge. I am, and I'm already aware of the challenge at hand, buddy. Alright. Uh, Sam says, also they're supposed to have an earthquake weather, but they cut it during the making. Oh, that's too bad. That would have been cool. Yeah, GTA Online 100% is hard, but if you want all the achievements, then you gotta do it, I guess. Yep, that's what we got to. Gen C Torday, welcome to stream. Dude, please don't spam the chat, dude. Okay, Gen C, you gotta calm it, dude. You've put seven messages in a row. Don't do that. You could easily combine those into one message. Please don't screw up the stream chat that way, man. All right. Anyway, like, I'm glad to have you here. Don't get me wrong. But don't spin, send seven messages in a row in like under 30 seconds. That's just, it's just aggravating. All right, guys, here we go. Here's the hospital. Nothing. Oh, then why did we come? Your faces. Think about a yellow rubber duck. You tripping again? Shh. I see what's going on. Is okay. that the second guy? I've seen enough. Let's go see if we can find Wayne. He's working a hot dog van at the tram terminal in Kings. Wait. Come on, dude. What's all that about? You don't want to know. Why? Do you know what a subdermal neurophone is? A what? Exactly. Sometimes it's best to stay in the dark, kid. We. What? We drove over there for no reason, just to satisfy crazy dudes to... Wow. Oh, hey, an actual hot dog truck. Eh! Alex's dogs. What's up, man? Dude, Hop in the whip. Wayne, man, how's the hot dog business? It's totally shit. Why? What's happening? Uh, my friend Carl here is opening a chop shop. Jethro's in. How about you? Uh, yeah, cool, man. Uh, I've got like some shit to take care of first though. So uh, you tell me where you guys are gonna be at and I'll meet you dudes there. The garage is on the waste grounds in Dory. I'll see y'all later. So okay. why it next stop, cop station downtown. What? Watch your mom. Why? If I told you, the likelihood is you'd get a probe up your ass within a month. Like listen to the man, dude. He's real serious about that shit. Wow. Okay, but you're starting to freak me out with all that spaceship, man. Wow. All right then. Okay. Anyway, he says seven messages in a row. Do I get timed out now? Do you get timed out now? No, I don't have to time you out. You didn't send seven messages in a row. Boniasi says howdy. What's up, Boniasi? Welcome to stream. All right, Steve, go home. Good to see you too, buddy. Furthest I got in San Andreas is the Zero Helicopter mission. Why is that, Bob? Truth is one of the best characters in GTA history. He's a funny dude. I like him. I don't know why we're going down by the police station near the subway, though. Guess we'll find out. Oh, this is a good song. Gotta love White Wedding. What's up, chicks? Eh. There we okay. go. You know the drill. Don't look interested in anything. Picture a pink golf ball in your mind. A okay. Pink. Okay. We're good to go. Where to next, spacehead? There's an electronics guy I've had dealings with. Goes by the name of Zero. He could fix a supercomputer with a paperclip. He's got his own shop, but he's always ready to help fellow travelers along the path. Let's go introduce you to him. Look, what's going on, True? Look, what's going on, True? Who was him dude? Don't go there. 
Listen to Jethro. Now, what if I That's weird. He said it twice. JFK lives in Scotland with Janis Joplin. And the only reason we've been in a Cold War for the last 45 years was because snake-headed aliens run the oil business. I think you popped another microphone, Doc. Good. Keep it that way. So basically, some whacked out conspiracy theorists, basically. Which is why he's having us drive him around to all these locations that have these vans we... I don't get it, but hey, you know people. I guess that's what's important. Bob says I got bored of San Andreas after that. Oh, I see. Alright, let's go over here. It's a nice day to start again, I can't lie. Zero's missions, zero missions are easy and fun, but a lot of people hate it. Just like Vice City RC missions. Yeah, people can be very particular with certain mi- Oh! Oh, hey, check it! There's an RC right there! Is he the one with it, I'm guessing? Yeah! Leave me alone, Berkeley. This is stalking. Oh, hey, Troop. Get in. I'll fill you in as we drive. Home, James. <laughs> my, my name's Zero. Carl. Zero, Carl. Sup? Carl here is open in a garage around the corner. I told him you're the man to speak to when it comes to electronics. That's cool. <laughs> Actually, I'm the only man to speak to. <laughs> Grade A tip top genius. That's me. You should is it now? Sometime. See some of my shit, bro. I'll do that. All right, cool, I guess. Now what? Am I supposed to go in? Oh, yeah, I am. All right, guys. I think his uh, well, we shop is one of the work. businesses we can buy. We're transform this place. Hey, Caesar, come over here. Got some good music. Up, That's already improvement. Just Jethro, Dwayne, and Zero. Hey, man, dude. Salutations, my sibling. Orale, let's mm. get to work. Hey, hey, Carl, look. I think I found a way for us to get paid. I ain't going Ow. to no college to study no account. No, idiot property. Decorating ain't exactly my thing either. No, property development. Look, you buy a dump like this, fix it up, and sell it. Or better yet, you turn the property into a business. The snowball gets bigger. I don't know, sis. This all sound big time to me. Look, Carl, this place is going to get on its feet. And when it does, we are going to have money. If you want to make something of yourself, you got to let your money work for you. Look, I wow. wouldn't even know where to start. Look. You two concentrate on the garage and let me work the property thing, okay? Yeah, that's my baby girl right there, Holmes. <laughs> Man, you chose her. I'm stuck with it. <laughs> Alright, so does that mean we can buy businesses now? Mission passed. Maybe. Alright, well, good stuff, guys. So let's go ahead and save real quick. So I'm thinking maybe, very possibly, we now have the opportunity to buy some uh, businesses. Cassie wasn't supposed to say it two times. Yeah, I'm aware of that. So, oh, hold up. What's up? Yeah, what? Sorry, Carl. Are you busy? Zero? Nah, man. Good to hear from you. What's up? Disaster. My landlord is selling the shop. I'll have nowhere to live and no safe haven from Berkeley. Ah, uh, I'm looking to invest in some property at the moment. Maybe I'll swing by. That worked out great. Look how well that worked out. All right, so I'm going to buy me a new safe house up here and save at it. We're going to invest us in some property. Like I said, his business was one we could buy. We're going to check that out. Uh, we've got another CJ mission. That's now a zero mission. It's probably what's going to unlock businesses for us. We've got another stadium where we can do a stadium event. we got a gym. We're going to avoid that, though. I'm trying to lose some muscle so I can attract this girl out in the country. And uh, buy some more property? Yeah, we got trucking missions again to do as well. So we've got tons and tons of good stuff to go through today. All right. Uh, Psycho Monkey says, I feel like Truth is not human. <laughs> Why, do you think he's, a, he's an alien lizard? Is that what you think he is, man? Zero missions are hated because of the controls. Well, this is the Defam edition. The controls have changed a little bit. Bomb says, I've started playing San Andreas now, though, and I'm having more fun now for some reason. I don't know. My attention span is extended. Yeah, that's probably just... From getting older, dude, because that happened to me. When I was, as I got older, my attention span got a lot better. Time to get into the business game. Awesome. So, Cass, have you ever watched Arrested Development? I think I watched like three episodes of it. I didn't care for it very much, though. But my buddy told me it was something you had to watch for a while to really get into. Steam event crashes the game. Don't do it. Now, they fixed that, dude. They updated the game and they fixed it. The car showroom doesn't unlock until a couple of missions in. Oh, okay. 
So, good to know. Uh, wait, car showroom. You're not talking about the stadium, right? Anyway. Uh, let's go ahead and buy this next property here. All right, 20K. There we go. Brown Streak Railroad. Go for the brown. Wow. All right, let's go inside here real quick while everybody's screaming and running down the sidewalk. All righty. I already saved, too. I don't even really need to save. I'm just doing it because reasons. Okay, so what's next order of business? Let's go ahead. I'll tell you what next order of business is. Let's go down to Zero's shop and talk to him. That's our next order of business. And now the cops are going to come after me, right? Of course they are. I just stole some guy's thing right in front of them. It was bound to happen. I mean, come on. What the hell are they talking about? I don't even know. I don't even care. Let's go ahead and check out Zero's shop. What's up, Zero? What's good, man? Zero RC. E to buy this property. Do I have to? So the Z is just is just to buy it. There's no actual mission to go along with it. Oh, cool. Property bought. Thirty thousand. A little more expensive than the safe house. And that got rid of the cops, which is funny. So that was all that there was to it. There's no actual mission that goes along with it. Unless the mission starts from in here. Huh. Is that zero? Doesn't really look like zero. What's up, man? No, it's not zero. It's one of his hired goons. Oh, you want some? You want some, boy? Come at me. Come at me. Boom. Boom. I love how I'm beating up my employee now. All right, now, lady, put your arms down. This isn't a robbery. Okay, I'm causing problems. I'm just going to get out of my own store. I love how I just buy a store and the first thing I go inside and do is go inside and abuse my employees. Hello? What's up, man? It's Zero. Oh, hi, Z. You wasn't around when I signed the deeds. Yes, I know. I was on a dangerous reconnaissance mission deep into enemy territory. Uh, yeah, right, sure. Whatever you say. I should come through and have a look at the business, you know? Oh, of course, of course. I'll have to tidy up a bit. This place is such a mess. Well, wait for that. I'll drop in soon. Literally, I'm right there. Oh, there's the zero mission. There it is. All right, so we can go ahead and start. Hey, thank you. I appreciate the compliment. I don't know what he said. I wasn't paying attention. Eh. Oh, man. Cast no, it's a business right next to your garage. Oh, the car dealership place. Oh, okay, that's cool. Zero's actor is in Arrested Development. He's called Tobias. Oh, that's cool. I didn't know that. All right, anyway, Jack Eugen, welcome to the stream. Same old cops. Busta straight busta. Oh, yeah. Cass, if you need help with RC missions, I can help you that way. Uh, you don't pull your hair out. Sounds good, dude. I think I'll be okay, though. Let's decline this time. I don't know what anybody's saying. All right. I get pretty demotivated from streaming because I have streams where I get zero views at all times. It's depressing. It destroys my motivation. That's just how streaming starts off, man. You have to start there and then just build up an audience. So. Besides, when you're first starting, it's better that hey, nobody up, watches. See? Nothing is up, Carl, apart from my blood pressure and the imminent collapse of my hopes and dreams. Yikes. Why? As usual, the forces of darkness have triumphed over good. Life is nothing but misery, briefly interspersed with agony. Homie, what you own? Whatever it is, you need to reduce the dosage. <laughs> Excuse me, but I never take drugs. We all They're know selling Vice City stuff in here. And or sex maniacs. And right now, sex is the last thing on my mind. Thank God for that. Berkeley is back. Oh, Who? Berkeley. Yes. Who the fuck is Berkeley? Just a man I once beat in fair competition. A man literally obsessed with revenge. Oh, you put hands on him? No, please. <laughs> I never initiate violence. Never. Oh, I know. You knocked this bitch. Uh, no. I won the prize in the science fair. <laughs> First prize, that is. Okay. And now you want to pop you? <laughs> no. And they say gangbangers is petty as small mind. See, he's a nerd is, is what I'm getting from this. 
Hey, what's that bleeping sound? Uh oh. We shall fight to the end. All right, guys, here we go. Full scale attack. This is insanity. All batteries commence fire. Wait, He's going what? For transmitters. If he takes them out, I'll never be able to launch a counter attack. Oh, they're no fighting one another with the model the planes. Toys. They're not toys. They're just smaller. Use the minigun to eliminate okay. the enemy Focus threat. Nice. That is so cool. What a cool Ready. thing Don't for mission. Cocky. There's one behind me. Nice. Whoop. Okay, there's one down. Nice. One behind me. RC Barons at nine o'clock high, Carl. Eh. Oh, there's a group of them over here. Stink. We got more over there. Goodness. Dusty Egg, welcome to the stream, dude. KJ1, good to see you. Anthony Tank, welcome all you guys. Hope you're having a good one. Nice haircut also off work. Hey, good on you, buddy. All right, zero missions are quite unique and fun, apart from the third one, which I always finish last second but not fail. Mm, okay. You don't actually have to do zero's missions to beat the entire game. Oh, okay. Is it all right to start with it, or am I not supposed to? Same thing with making videos. Managed to get the funny number of subs after six or seven years of having a channel. Yeah, it just takes time, and it's better not to have a bunch of people watch your content when you're first starting anyway, because most of your starting content isn't very good. You know what I mean? It takes practice. Oh man, the cutscene burning your brain from trying to do this mission. Huh, interesting. All right, uh, Cass, do you see characters from Manhunt 1? I've never played Manhunt 1, dude. Zero missions have been nerfed for the Definitive Edition. I believe it. Missions were very difficult in PS2 days, but as PC folks back in 2000 utilized settings to beat those missions. <laughs> I bet. Anthony Tank says, hey, how are you? I watched your video on the core operation madness. Good job, man. I'll continue to make some more maps in the future. Thank you for your positive support. You're welcome, buddy. It was fun playing your map. Troy says, I hated the zero mission. Why? Why'd you hate it? Uh, also, how's lung therapy going, Troy? Trust me, it will, if you make zero missions, the shop will give you money. Oh, awesome. Well, we definitely want some money. This is what we gotta do to make the shop profitable, so be it, I suppose. All right, they're dropping like flies now, which is nice. Whoop, bye-bye. Nice, one more. That's a lot of model planes. That's gonna be costing this guy. Eh, just fell on that rooftop. Whereas some of them, no, I guess they all kind of explode and then fall down. Nice. Yeah, this is uh, not very hard on the Definitive Edition, I will say that. This one's getting a little close. Our knees down. It's a lot of planes. Do I have enough bullets left? I think so, yes. Oh. You can't hear the bullets firing anymore. Look, I'm shooting them, but you can't hear them. That is so awkward. Wow. <laughs> you can't hear the bloody bullets, ladies and gentlemen. They're just, they're just gone. No more bullet sounds. Wow. Wow. Okay. All right, wow, we got a lot of those from a distance too. Oh, crap, crap. Oh, that was close. That was a close one. Nice. Nice. Yeah, definitive. Yep, super definitive. You, hey, bullet sounds are annoying. Who wants to hear that? Let's just take them out and call it definitive. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Yeah, it's really a shame how buggy this game is. Because it's so fun in spite of it. Oh, man. All right. There's the planes. Anybody else? Plenty of them over there. Oh, you can hear them blowing up. How many planes are there? 
What's this guy do? Own like a model plane factory? Goodness gracious. Oh, oh, it's for time. Oh, I didn't realize there was a timer countdown. Oh, that explains it. Okay, you gotta protect it. It's like one of those Saints Row missions where you gotta protect something while the time counts down. There we go. GG. <laughs> Berkeley. As long as Loser! We, we will fight you. Opposable thumbs. Well done, Carl. Now leave. I must prepare for the battles ahead. Never have so few owed so many. Too little three... No, that's not it. What is it? We will fight him on the beaches. Well, rooftops. Wow. Okay. I don't know what the stink that was, but that was cool. 3,000 bucks. I'll take it. Oh, man. You can do them whenever. I usually do them now, but it's kind of fun to do them after finishing the game for extra missions. That makes sense. I don't really want to focus too much on YouTube since I want to make guitar my main focus in life. There you go, Bob. Do that. Sam says, Cass, it doesn't matter when you start the zero missions, but it does make sense to do it during Act 2. Okay. Uh, these missions were notoriously hard back in the day. Much easier in this, though. Yeah, that's, they're not very challenging in this, so they must have been a lot harder. So. Don't sleep with your sister, fool. That guy, <laughs> that guy told me to wash myself, so I just insulted him right back. Oh, man. Anyway. Cass is that powerful. All he has to do is look at something to cause distraction. <laughs> Oh man, yeah, that was that was great. Anthony says I recently watched your pre-recorded live stream on Doom 64. Pre-record? There's no what? There's no pre-recorded live stream. Did you mean premiere? I didn't do a premiere on Doom 64, dude. Did you mean live stream archive while eating takis and set my mouth on fire? Good job, man. Uh, tip: Shoot zero to skip mission without fail due to programming error. Eh. That's funny, KJ1. Oh, you had deodorant? Well, you look like a man. Oh, yeah, baby, let's brawl. Hello? What is wrong with you, you skinny, weird, little wizard-looking woman? You want to brawl, huh? Yeah. There you go. Sit the stink let's down. Not so fun now, is it? Ooh. All right. Oh, there's the blood. There's the blood. All right. Anyway, what are we talking about? Of course, GTA Definitive Edition. It's gonna be fun because it's based off the OG. Exactly. One thing that won't make it fun is game breaking bugs. Yep. Definitive is so much easier. Oh yeah, I'm sure it is. Yeah, a lot of things were rebalanced in this, so I'm I'm sure it's much easier. Okay. Hey Z, where you at? Go away, Carl. I'm I'm very, very busy <clears throat> back here. Top top secret stuff, not for your eyes. Too sensitive. Come on, homie, where are you? I said go away, Carl. I don't need any friends today. Thank you. <laughs> then Nymph's a pretty strong draw. Yes, my hero. Carl, he came back and humiliated me. Oh. I shall probably turn to prostitution now, where I will be found dead and broken. <laughs> oh, I man. I'm a 28 year old man whose landlord just helped him down from a hook from which I had been hanging from my underwear, contemplating my inadequacy for nearly two hours. Ow, my crack. Look, you gotta get even, homie. What kind of weapons you got? Uh, I've got a prototype of a miniature plane. Oh, well, with that plane, we gonna go humiliate Berkeley. Mm. Okay, cool. Man, this is ridiculous. Now, oh, I'm right loving going after Berkeley. This is fun. Oh, man. Dang, you've killed Mark Zuckerberg's wife. Have I? Lackeys do all his deliveries. Well, we shall hit him where it hurts the most. Bring his mail order model business to its knees. Wow, okay. Launch the Red Baron. Launch the Red Baron. Oh, this is a good song for this. All right, how do I control this again? Oh, yeah. You use the mouse, that's right. Yeah, this is kind of awkward controls. Wait a minute, timeout, timeout. I don't remember the plane controls. Hold up, controls, adjust way out. Fly to send, left mouse button, fight to send, right mouse button. Oh, okay, and then it's E for the weapon, and then it's the arrows to steer. Okay, all right, I get it, I get it now. So, Cass, are you thinking about playing some City Skylines in the future? Oh, yeah, we'll do that at some point. I actually already own the game, too. 
So yeah, I like city bu building games. We'll do a whole bunch of those at some point. Destroy the couriers before they complete their deliveries. Believe me, nothing would make me happier, but unfortunately this thing controls like a piece of garbage. I guess that's what people meant when they said they, uh, the missions are hard. I remember the Vice City one I had trouble with too. Wait, wait, time out. I remember I used a controller for these because they fly like garbage, right? Wait, I thought they fixed the flight though in the update. And they probably didn't. They probably just said they did. Song Welcome to Jungle. It's a good song. Oh, man. In case you want to park behind the car slash bikes, but don't start shooting. You want to make sure they can't turn left or right. And then you shoot them. Okay. Sounds good. Hold up. I'm turning around. I'm going after them. Uh, or not. This is ridiculous. I cannot control this thing. All right. Time out. I'm getting a controller out. Nope, it's just not happening today. Ow. You guys saw that, right? That was painful. All right, that's my fault for unwrapping the controller too hard. Oh, and now it's all wrapped on my hand. Good good job, Cass. Uh, okay. Okay. All right. All right. So, got an Xbox 360 controller here. Going to plug it in. It. There we go. All right, now that that's done, let's go ahead and take this and try this nonsense again. There we go, and now I can magically control it. You guys know why? It's because the controls semi-work for controller. They just don't work for keyboard and mouse. At least not very well. Oh, I, I take it back. Even this is still pretty janky. Oh, wait a minute, I'm using this one. Oh, okay. Oh my gosh, quit going in circles, you stupid plane! You guys are right. This mission sucks. Oh my gosh, okay. Try the other one, let's go up. This way. Ugh. Yeah, I, I don't want to come down. You're right. Line it up behind the courier. Nothing would make me happier, buddy. How the hell do you control this piece of garbage? Why to self-destruct? Well, oh, hold up. Let's back it up real quick. Yeah, come on. No, you stupid crap work. Oh, it's the other, it's the other thing I see. It's the other trigger. Uh. There we go, that's better. Or not. Okay, let's pause real quick. Wow, just brought the Xbox game bar. Good job, Cass. All right, I'm starting this mission over because this is garbage. And I, I'm already just screwed myself up way too far to come back for this. Oh, man. Anyway. Well, he says, the controls, even on controller, suck. The plane physics aren't good. Yeah, they're terrible. Best mission ever. Guys, look at the controller scheme. Um, I think I figured it out just from playing around with it, but... Wait, what? There's, there's no controller scheme. So it just shows a mouse and keyboard. They don't have a con... Oh, you meant look it up online. No, I'm not doing that either. I, I figured it out enough from context. I will say this, though. Humiliation yeah, yeah, we complete. get it. I'm going to try... I'm going to start over and try this again. Uh, one hour later. I know, right? So you know how to fly with control. Yeah, it's exactly like the uh, Vice City one, more or less. It's just... It's just... Uh, It's just janky is the problem. Like, see what I mean? Janky. Janky is all get out. Now here's what I don't understand. How do you, how do you steer? 
Why this, the right joystick doesn't steer. Is it the left one? That doesn't steer either. There's no way to steer. Oh, maybe it's because it's on the ground. Oh, uh, that's what it is. Okay. So it's the, it's the left one that steers. Okay. But only when it's in the air. I, I see. Okay. I got it. I got it, boys. Check it. Nice. All right, so that's how we get that. If I can climb up in the sky again, we'll go after another one. This is like the goofiest mission ever. And it's like you're barely able to even kind of figure, well, no, I guess we're kind of getting it in a manner of speaking. Well, that didn't work. Crap, crap, crap. He's getting my point. Back it up, Cass. Back it up, you garbage. Back. Oh, that didn't work at all. Now he's just shooting at my plane. Go back. Go back. Turn around. I'm trying. I'm trying so hard to pull this off. It just sucks. Go up. Joy! Why can't I kill this guy? There we go. I got him. And my plane's on fire. Wow. This mission is awful. Oh, man. Anyway, I think I like that it gives you the option to restart on fail. I think. Yeah, I like that, too. Mm. Uh, all right. LB and RB. I've been, uh, I've been using RT and LT. I haven't really used LB and RB. I'll try those. Cats, make sure you use RB and LB to move left and right. Oh, okay. That's what I'm doing wrong. Berkeley has a sycophantic that makes more sense. Deliveries. Thank you, guys. Well, we I always forget about LB and RB because I'm not really used to controllers. Let me hold it correctly. Yeah, okay, okay buddy. Um, I can't tell if that's it or not. No, I think it's really just the joystick. I don't think LB or RB do much. Okay, so I guess I, sh I guess that's why you guys told me to get up behind him and then start shooting before, instead of shooting before we were properly lined up, since they can just get out and shoot at us. Yeah, hold up. Oh, steer is LB and RB. Huh, you were right. Oh, it's while you're on the ground. Okay, that makes more sense. So it's joystick while in the air and LBRB while on the ground. Okay. Crap. No, no, too late. Too late. F for Cass. I know, right? Hmm. Hey, Cass, is it okay you could give me your interpretation of the Master Chief? Nope. Uh, Cass, why is fuel going down so slowly? I could fly in one direction and watch a movie and come back, and I would still complete the mission. <laughs> ah, Draven Bailey, welcome to the stream, dude. It's good to see you. LB and RB on the, gr on the ground. Not in the air, though. In the air, it's uh, left joystick to fly. I don't know why that is. That fire effect is so big. It's not only is it big, it's like delayed. It's like when you're flying, it's like behind the plane. It's really weird looking. It's funny, you can really tell the remaster was not finished at all because there's like certain things that have been like changed and improved upon. It's like super obvious. And then there's other stuff that like, it's either, 
exactly the same as the old one, or in many cases, worse. You know what I mean? Like, they just hadn't gotten to it yet or something. Hey, there we go. All right, I'm starting to get it better now. Hold up. Uh... Hold up, we're gonna back it up again. Back it up. Back it up. There we go. Okay. Now go forward. Line it up behind the courier. Okay. Oh, going going the wrong way. Stupid grass. Oh man. I forget how like unused to the controller I am till I try to start using one. All right, Kari, you are really messing me up, dude. You are really messing me the stink up here. Dude, go to the right. Go to the right. There we go. I did it. That's how you do it, son. Come on. Come on. Go up. Get some altitude, son. It's good for you. There we go. All right, boys, now that we kind of did that, I think I got a bit better of an idea, I hope. Eh. All right, let's try this again. Uh, hold up. Yeah, we're just gonna, we're just gonna go down this way. We're just gonna chill for a moment. Wow. Guess out there drifting the plane on the grass. Yeah, I don't know. I'm just, I just feel like really incompetent controlling this. I'm trying though. And it really does, son. It really does get worse. Wow, this is terrible. Like, I, I can't even bear, I can barely even steer. Like, look, look at it, look. It's just terrible. All right, anyway, it's no big deal. We got behind the truck. All right, here we go, guys. Here we go. Why? Why? You idiot trash. Should have been able to move. Wrong way. Come on, go up, up, up! And now it's stuck in the ground. There you go. Now it's not stuck. It's still stuck. There we go. I don't like how much attention I drew to myself there, but at least we got out of that predicament we were in. All right, hold up. I'm gonna turn around here. Go up this way. I'm going to take a break and re-chat for a second. I remember playing this mission for weeks. I can see why. It's terrible. So, I hate this mission so much. Yeah, no, this mission sucks. What's funny, too, is we went from that last mission, which was, like, painfully easy. A child could have done with its eyes closed, right? Whereas this mission, which is just ridiculous. <laughs> I did this on first try. Good, good job, buddy. Fire Effect and Definitive Edition looks like Chicken Invaders Universe Ghost Trail Cosmetic. I could see it. Oh, man, 1403 Gamer TV. Welcome to the stream, dude. Mm. I think it does still work on flying, too. It's just not as noticeable in this plane, at least I think. I think you're actually right, Lily. Okay. Catch Cammy the controller so I can help you out. <laughs> Guys out there drifting the plane on the grass. Yeah. Yeah. What, what can you do? Also, Cash, you don't lose 
gas until you press X or whatever the drive button is, just like an OG. You mean the you mean the fuel? Okay, okay. Well, it's not. There's no. You don't use X. The accelerate button is uh, LT and RT to go backwards and forwards. All right. Anyway, have you tried LB and RB in the air? Yes, yes. It does help somewhat, but mostly it's the joystick that's going to help you move around. So, uh, KJ1 says, anyone who is saying this mission is the hardest is a weakling since the actual hardest mission is learning to fly, which can be completed quite easily if you don't care about medals. But journey to gold medal is hell. Yeah, I'm, I'm sure it will be. I'll, I'll, I'm sure we'll get to that point too. <laughs> wearing to fly uh, is fine, but going for gold isn't that easy. Mm, well, that's, that's going to happen later. Buy GTA Plus to pass this mission. Oh yeah, there you go. There you go, man. What 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 could possibly go wrong there, right? Oh, dude, I'm so sick of flying this stupid airplane. All right, we got at least four more places or things or whatever we got to hit first. So the fuel. So based on what Sam was telling me, the fuel doesn't. Is it lost as easily in the Definitive Edition? I guess that's one thing, anyway. I guess that's one thing to be happy about. You know what's not, though? Getting stuck in this stupid little pit over here. Gosh. Ah. All right, this music is distracting me. I'm turning that off. All right, back it up. Back it up. Come on. Dude. Press Y to self-destruct. I will. Oh, doesn't actually work. <laughs> Self-destructing doesn't even work. Of course, I don't even want to do that because then we have to start all over again. Thank goodness! I finally got out! Wow, that was annoying. It's like the plane just turns and does whatever the hell it wants to and so forth. Yeah. All right. We're gonna go up the street here. We're gonna get this little stinker. That's what we're gonna do. All right. Finally, somewhat level on a level playing field with him, I feel like. Or not, maybe. Oh, here we go. Here we, no, he moved a different street again. Dang nabbit. Get out of my way, idiot. All right. I think without all that music playing, I'm able to pay a little bit better attention. My mind was too all over the place. All right, let's go up here. Come on. Come on, baby. You're so close. You're so close. Beautiful. Beautiful. Or not. Turn around, you idiot. Go up. Go up. Go up! Oh, I hate this mission so much. Okay. Hold on. Go up. Go up. 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 Up! You idiot trash! I hope you die! Ugh! Okay. All right. Back it up. Back it up. Go back. 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 Yeah, nobody cares. Go back. Go back. Back! Uh, okay. Go up here. Ah! <sighs> don't don't give me the option to self-destruct game. It's too tempting. Oh gosh, you know what? You know what? Ah! How do I stop it and restart it? I want to start over again. I'm just so tired of this stupid mission. You know what I am going to do though? I'm going to try doing it con keyboard and mouse again, which is probably going to suck, but I'm going to try it again anyway because the controller is still awful. I thought it would be like in Vice City where like, My humiliation I thought it would be like in Vice City complete. where uh, the planes were a lot easier with controller, but it's still terrible. It's still just awful. Mm. Baby Yoda says hi. What's up, Baby Yoda? So, yeah, I can see why you guys were warning me about this mission now. It's, it's, it's truly terrible. 
All right, let's try this again. Oh, wait a minute. One other thing I gotta check. Let me look at the controls one more time. Because I was on controller. Uh, where is this? E, okay, send. So it's left mouse button and right. This is like the dumbest possible way you could do it. Why on earth would you do it that way? Left mouse button and right mouse button? That just, that just does not make any sense at all. Alternate flight, steer left, steer up and steer down. So it's the arrow keys, and then left mouse button and right mouse button, and then E and Q. Okay. Bring his mail order model let's, let's try it. I don't know. What the stink? Launch the Red Baron. Can't understand. Hold W to increase the thrust. So it is W and S then. Okay. So it's Oh, okay. An alternative to commercial. Actually doesn't really have anything to do with the mouse very much. It's arrow keys and W and S primarily. Okay, so this actually isn't that bad, guys. I was just doing the controls totally wrong. Okay. I mean, well, don't get me wrong, it's still bad, but the hell? That doesn't make any sense. There we go. We got him. All right. See? See? It was W and S plus the arrow keys. Left mouse button and right mouse button have nothing to do with it. And then E to, to shoot. So that's what that was. I think. Actually, now I'm not so sure. Yeah, it's, it's like I said, it's janky, but we got it. Yeah, I hate this mission so bad. I know, right, Trey? But it's terrible. It, it had some cool music, though, except I'm going to turn it back off again. Because, once again, it is distracting as hell. Even though it's good. All right. Cass, I don't know what you're talking about. It's one of the easiest missions in GTA history. You have no idea what you're talking about, Sam. Can you change the controls? So I click on them to change them. I could, but I don't want to mess anything up. And now that I actually figured out how it is, it's it's actually fine. So I love this song. Yeah, that's a good song. So, but uh, what is too distracting? I'm just gonna hear nothing but the plane. That's 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 it. That's all I want to hear is is the beautiful noises of the plane and the screams from the people who are dying that we're shooting. That's that's all I want to hear. Okay, that's not too much to ask. Right, go up here. Go up here. Turn around. But yes, when all is said and done, very good song. And... Nice. All right, so got that. So we got two of them. Which means there's a couple more somewhere. Hold up, where's the closest one to us? We got, where are we at? I don't know, oh, we're over there, okay. We're gonna go to this one first, so let's go over there real quick, and then, then we'll be good. Fun fact, GTA um, Advance has the same music as GTA 2. Does it really? That makes sense. It was it was really their uh, first time doing a spin-off title. Makes sense they wouldn't want to get any new music, license any new music for it. They could just use what they already have. Plus, GTA 2 didn't even sell that well, I don't think. Well, I guess it had to have sold at least re relatively decently for the time. In fact, it probably did better than Advance. <laughs> OG glitch from the OG Xbox, bro. What was? I thought you said my name when you said janky. Oh, no. No. I just meant the controls were janky. I'm going to sit and imagine alternate universe where Cass is good at this mission for five minutes. What are you talking about? I'm doing great now. Now that I figured it out. Okay, maybe make great's a strong word. I'm at least semi-competent now. I am at least semi-competent, ladies and gentlemen. Okay, look. 
Come on, hold up. Oh, you're gonna see. You're gonna see, it's gonna happen. Okay, see? See, I can fly a plane. Where, where's where's the faith in my ability to figure it out? I, I had to open my big mouth, didn't I? Yep. Nice. All right, so that's destroyed. We got two more, boys, and we're good. All right. GTA Advance is GTA 1 music. Oh, GTA 1? Okay, so not GTA 2, then. Uh, da, da, da. GTA Advance was three top down but got changed later. Really? That's weird. Alright, anyway. Well, he says that doesn't talk much of an advancement if they use the same music, shaking my head. <laughs> yeah, you are right about that. It's a good job Kess is a YouTuber and not a pilot. Wow. Wow. Hey. Pilot planes wouldn't control, real planes wouldn't control like this. This is an RC plane with what essentially amounts to a remote control. Come on, give your boy some credit. Hey, I'll say one thing. I'll say one thing for myself, all right? When we get to Microsoft Flight Simulator rise to the top, you'll feel differently about my pirating skills. Piloting skills, excuse me, not pirating skills. Those weren't, those aren't on, those aren't in question here. Dude, I was doing so good. Dude, you ruined it for me, you stupid building. Oh, stick. Okay, hold up. Hold up. I swear I'm good. I, I'm good, I promise. <laughs> oh, crap. Okay. We're just gonna go over here. Hey, at least we still have plenty of fuel. At least, at least there's that. They would if you flew it, lol. <laughs> Okay, let's go over here. And... All right, see guys, I'm getting around. I'm doing it. Oh goodness. Poor Cash. Yeah, I know, right? Hey, at least we're getting it done. Here, you know what? I'm gonna turn the music back on. I'm just gonna turn it to something different from what we're listening to. Let's listen to Master Sounds. That sounds good. Oh, that was a terrible idea. Never mind. Back to KDST, the station that's good. I've said it before. All you need to get through this life is Are you serious, dude? Come on. That was such bo so bogus. All right, we're almost here. Oh, it's a guy in a bike too. Here we go. Here we go. They don't see me either, which makes it even better. Dang, damn it. Let's go, son. Let's go. Get destroyed. Just no, my plane. My plane. No! I only had one more! Come on! Look at the fuel meter. Who cares about the fuel meter? It was... There was... It, it caught on fire. Because this is easy with touch controls. <laughs> Whatever. Uh, mm. Alright, this mission sucks. Yeah, it does. Okay, let's try it again, guys. Let's try it again. I think we're gonna get it this time. Because I've really gotten the controls down pat a lot better. Dang you, well, Berkeley! I know, right? The most. Bring his mail order model business to its knees. Okay. Okay. It's gonna be okay. We just, we just. I, I practiced the controls. I know so much better what's going on. Oh crap! 
Hold up, this isn't gonna work. He's already shot me too much. No, oh, or not. Okay, never mind. Maybe it will work. It's taking forever because I can't barely control the thing. Of course it's taking forever. Destroy the couriers for they complete their deliveries. Crap. Ugh. Controls went back to being trash. You have diabetes and the kids want to play with the medical equipment? Is that what they said? Oh, I certainly hope not. Wow, he's really trying his best to ride that bike. What? Yes, okay, there's one. All right, who else? Uh... Now they're kind of spread out now. Okay, we got one over here, and then we got two others. Oh, crap. All right, turn around. Let everyone represent. There we go. The fuel meter wasn't even halfway done. It was not. You were correct. It was not done at all. Now, remind, remind me, KJ1, in the original version, the fuel meter played a lot bigger of a deal, right? I'm assuming that got changed around in this a lot. Okay, this is sort of working. Okay, it's, it's the guy down in the little bin to see who we're going for, guys. Just kind of like last time, really. Let's go, Cash. You can do it. Thanks, Draven. This is worse than the mission in Vice City. The Vice City mission actually was fine once I switched to a controller, which is what I thought was going to be the solution to this, but it, it's really not. It's just as hard with a controller, if not more difficult. I actually understand the controls for this now, so I'm doing fine. Oh, this is going to be perfect. They can't go nowhere. There you go. There you go, baby. That's how it's done. Alrighty, guys. So with that done, let's go get those last two, shall we? All right, what platform do I use? I am PC all the way, son. <clears throat> Excuse me, guys. My voice keeps giving out today. All right, all you had to do was demolition, man. All you had to do was demolition, man. You know what? Oh, man. All right. Yeah, in the old version, I used to kill everybody and then just run out of fuel. Oh, that's funny, dude. So, yeah, I, I imagine the original was a good bit harder. That being said, it's still relatively challenging on the Definitive Edition. And by relatively, I mean, you know, a lot of the missions in the Definitive Edition are easier than in the original just because they got rebalanced. So, like I said, relatively still still difficult. But I guess it's doable. Who cares about hunger and oppression? We've got ego to worry about. Alright guys, hopefully Bike Boy won't screw me up this time. Maybe I should go for the other one first. Let's do that. Let's go for the, nah, well, no, nah, I'm already right here. Nah, let's just do it, we're already here. So, that's what she said, no. No, 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 never mind. All right. <laughs> Dude, gotta turn, there you go. Let's get right behind the police here, hold up. Nice, we got him. All right, one more, boys. One more. As long as we don't burst into flames while flying over here, I think we've got it. I think we got it, baby. Let's go. Jedi Batman 94, welcome to the stream. <clears throat> he said PS2 version, this was easy. Really, the PS2 version was easy? I doubt that. So. All right, are you winning, son? So far, not so much. Okay, let's go over here. 
I will say this about the plane. It has more health than an OG, but the fuel's about the same. It's the same? No, I think there's... Really? Because I'm not even halfway done. The mission's almost over. Oh, crap! Please let this distract you and make you blow up, please. Wow! Wow! Okay. Well, <laughs> thanks for the 655. I appreciate it. Truly. But uh, unfortunately, I don't think that accomplished quite what you were hoping it would. Because <laughs> I'm still good. I'm still not blown up yet. Oh, man. Thank you very much for the dono, Willie. I appreciate that. Wait, he's, he's backing up! What the hell? Why did that happen? I don't even know. He's just he, now he's just chilling. Now get her back home in one piece before she runs out of fuel. Oh, back home in one piece before she runs out. Okay. All right, guys. So uh, now with that done, I don't know why he backed up and then just chilled there at the side of the road, but it made for an easy last kill. Man, this sucks. Dude, move! Move! All right, I'm just gonna go home the regular way. way. No shortcuts. Woo! Oh my gosh. Please, we need a boom, baby. Eh. Thanks for the 655, Louie. I appreciate that. Crap! Crap, crap. All right, we're good. We're good. All right. All right, I doubt fuel will be an issue. Yeah, I, I have to agree with you, Bob. I don't think it will either, dude. Then getting there in one piece would be the main issue, but I think we're okay. Uh, this was just practice, guys. <laughs> exactly, Gen C, you get it. This was just the practice round, that, that's all. Hey, we got her done anyway. Guess the reason. Crap. Crap, 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 crap. All right. Guess the reason why they back up. Dude, this is so freaking annoying. There we go. That's much better. There we go. All right, finally. Kess, the reason they backed up is because they couldn't make it up the hill. It's not a bug, it was in the, it was in the original. Oh! Oh, okay, they couldn't make it up the hill. Oh, I see, that was, that was part of the mission design. I thought it was like a bug, like they just backed up for no reason. That's cool. All right, hold up, guys. Hold up. If old people keep harassing me, gatherings, Nobody's harassing you, woman. Get off the radio. All right, here we go. Yes! 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 Boom, baby! Mission passed. $5,000. The smell. You know that ozone smell. Smells like victory. Wow. That was awesome. And by awesome, I mean awful. Leaving Los Santos again. Mm. Okay, I'm on it. Let's do it. All right, guys. Time to go knock off a courier. And then we'll come back here and do another zero mission. So, yeah, that was crazy. That was, like, insanely aggravating. But we got her done. Can I get some GGs? Because that was awesome. All right, I kind of miss Maximum Doom. You had so much fun. I'm going to make Maximum Doom 2 folder and compile random files into a folder. Wow. Guess focus on the game to you pass the mission. Done. So, oh, a bunch of GG's. Thanks, everybody. Oh, dang it. G stinking G. <laughs> nice try anyway, Willie. All that for 5K. I know. Gosh, smells like victory. More like smells like victor. It smells like team spirit, I say. All right, let's go ahead and get us a car. 
Get out, fool. Get out of here. All right. So, going to listen to some good old Radio X, and we're going to go look for uh, that courier. Where are they? Oh, they're way over here. I'm going to have to start heading back over towards that town, aren't I? Yep. Let's, uh, I'll tell you what. Let's head over this way. Well, I cut him off that way. I just wanted a waypoint set up. Kess, was that as hard as everyone says? Yes. Learning it was. Once you have it down and know what you're doing, not really. So. But, like, initially trying to figure it out, that was aggravating. That was really fun, to be honest. Well, I'm glad you enjoyed it, Lily. All right, I'm going to take a faster car here. Excuse me, everyone. Just going to help myself to a faster vehicle. All right, get out. You, you can have my old one. Huh, the police are just walking right by me. They ain't even give a stink. All right, so where's this fool coming at? He is coming towards me, so we're, I am probably going to meet him, actually. All righty, guys. Time to go take this fool out. The RC missions are fun. Eh, they are. So, they're cool. Why even do the couriers, though, lol? There's, there's not really any reason to. I just I just wanted to. It's fun. I still... I've, I killed one in a vehicle already. I just haven't killed one on a bike yet. So, probably after I kill a bike one, I won't bother anymore. But, I mean, hey. We at least gotta give it a shot. Yeah. Well, I'm trying. Oh! Oh, he's coming for me. He's, he's aggressive. He's an aggressive little stinker. See ya, idiot. Right, come on, we're so close! <clears throat> hey, I needed to come over this direction anyway. I actually wanted to do another trucking mission. We might just take a, uh, a break from zero missions real quick. And do a trucking mission first before we continue. Oh, he's going up this way. Yeah, I think I'm gonna change my course ever so slightly. Wait, how do I get up there, though? Ooh, uh... There we go. Oh, now the now the now the waypoints don't work. That's weird. That's a little confusing, but all right. I'm almost ran in the water here. That wouldn't have been great. Oh look, the the fence just builds out into the into the space. Okay, that that's that's nice. And and the car fender just suspends in midair. What a what a great game. No, no, no real bugs or issues, really. Nah, it's, it's all good. Oh, man. Crap. Oh, man. I'm having a hard time even catching this fool. Uh, Denise says, hmm. Don't you be thinking I forgot about what you did to me last stream. <laughs> Denise, will you do me a favor and just get out of here? For goodness sakes. All right. Let's go up here. I said I was sorry. I don't know what more you want. All right, come on, move, move. There we go. All right, here we go. All right, I see them, they're coming this way. Are they going in the water? I don't know where they're going actually. Nah, they're just going in that town. All right, I, I can cut them off over here, boys. Yeah, here we go, son. All right, guys, here I go. Time to take out the courier, son. Give Big Smoke the middle finger. Hold up. They're going. They were going. I just should have stayed on that road. Dang, nab it! I hate when my cars get all turned around. It. They're so slow to get moving again. <clears throat> all right, here we go. Are they coming this way or are they turning right? They're turning right. No problem. Hey, what's up, courier? I don't know why my voice keeps going out. <clears throat> Probably just thirsty. Here, we'll take this guy out, and I'll take a little break. Go grab me some tea. Bring him the courier to get the cash. Woo! Give me that money, son. Oh, hold up. Pick up the cash. Yeah, I can I can see that. Uh, hold up, though. We got to go ram him again with a different vehicle this time, because that one got a wee bit damaged. So, could I just blow them up and get the cash that way? It just sounds so much easier. Probably not. 
Probably have to ram him. Oh, man, I'm here to haunt you, fool. Eh. Pescarte, that's a big name. It is. Big name. Match a big personality. Eh. <laughs> oh, wow. Bob says, oh, goodness, I'm not looking forward to when I have to play that mission at some point. Or I could just give up completing the game. Nah, you'll get it, Bob. Just keep at it, buddy. It's not even that hard. Here, I'll tell you, I'll tell you this. Wait, are you playing the original or the definitive edition? Because I can't tell you what it is in the original because I haven't played that. So. Eh. Hold up. Come on, fool. Go! Faster! <laughs> Stick. I'm trying so hard. Uh, Zygon, welcome to the stream, buddy. He says, wow, this is an Ozzy Osbourne song. Yes, it is, and it's a good one, too. Ozzy Osbourne had some good songs. This RV is so freaking slow. I should take the semi-truck and ram him with that. That's what I should do. That would be awesome. What are you doing? Man, what are you doing, dude? You were screwing me up something awful. All right, here we go. Here we go, son. Come here, buddy. Come here. There we go. We got one. Oh, there's some more. There's some more. Oh, they got my tire. Dang, nabbit. Hold up, guys. Here we go. Eh. Trying to shoot back at him. Even that's not doing much good. Thanks, man. Appreciate that. All you radio listeners who are nice. Oh crap, this is on fire now. Out, CJ! No! CJ! Ah! I stole $1,500 from the courier. Mm. Poor CJ. Can we get a rip in the chat for CJ, boys? <laughs> I'm afraid to play San GTA San Andreas because of that mission, are you? Oh, uh, you can get past it, dude. It's okay. You will survive, son. <laughs> Alright, so... Let's go ahead... Oh, what the hell? Okay, then. Um, let's, uh, let's go ahead and save again. All right. So, real quick, guys. I'm going to run upstairs and get me a glass of tea. Okay? And when I come back downstairs, we're going to... Where are we at? I don't know where we're at. Actually, yes, I do. We're over, uh... We're over here. Yeah. Okay. So, we're going to go over here next. We're going to do some more trucking missions. Then we're going to go back and do another Zero mission, and then we'll do a CJ mission. Keep going in uh, in a pattern, basically, yeah. And we're going to buy the rest of those uh, greenhouses around San Fierro. So, fun stuff. So, I will be right back. Don't go nowhere, nobody. I'll read the chat when I get back, too. Alrighty, guys, I'm back. Thank y'all for waiting on me. Doc755, welcome. He says, new haircut. Who dis? <laughs> welcome to the stream, Doc. All right, wasted. No, time wasted. Ah! Mm. It really was. We need a rip emoji. We do. I'll uh, I'll swap one out with, uh, with the rip one sometime soon. We might actually have enough members to just unlock one. I'm not sure. I'll have to look it up. Brett Alt, welcome to the stream, buddy. Says, hi, Kess. Hi, chat. Good to see you, Brett. Oh, good. Join the stream in time to see an empty chair. Timing is impeccable. I'm sorry about that, Doc. All right, I just had to get me some tea. All right, guys. So now that we're done and are left with basically no resources whatsoever, um, I'm going to go give me that do the truck mission. So, yeah. Well, I just joined, and this guy is showing an empty chair with a map in the background. See what the stink, man? I'm unsubbing. 
If you just joined, you wouldn't be able to un to un sing about it. Learn to keep your trap shut. Never mind. I stand by my man. They're all dead though. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> what the hell? I declare time for the Cairo's line. Who's calling it up? My cattle are vibrating. The music your boss makes you play, it really speaks to me. You're oh crud! That cabin just spoofed out of nowhere. Oh. Well, for that matter, so did my vehicle. Yeah, that's that's fine. That's that's great. Uh, Cash, you got that water. Yeah, I ran out of water, buddy. So I got me some I got me some tea. Uh, <laughs> all right, K Rose's best station. I'm not a big country music person, but it's a cool station. I can't lie. Besides, who can hate this? Hey, can I, wait, you know what? Wait, 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 I've got a surprise. I've got a surprise. Every, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. This will be worth it. All right, the music reminded me. Are you guys ready? It is time for the return, the glorious return of Cowboy Cast. Let's go. <laughs> oh, I had to just do that. I just had a brownie. Now, when you say brownie, are we talking like regular brownie or like brownie, you know? Might as well go bald if you're choosing the worst possible hairstyles for your hair. Wow, okay, KJ1. Tell us how you really feel, why don't you? See, the hair business is just clearly not your specialty. Unless you worship triangles. I have a little triangle, like, uh, shrine in my bedroom, as a matter of fact. Besides, you can eat this. Besides, I don't know, me. Yeah. Okay, make sure it's worth it. Was it? Was it worth it, Draven? He said, let's go. Yes, it was worth it. It was stinking worth it. I happen to know this song on the radio. It's All Maxes Live in Texas. Yes, it's a good song. Cowboy Cash should always be a thing. Yeah, it's true. Now do a hillbilly accent. Okay. Let's, let, me, let me see. Let's, let's think of a hillbilly accent. Hold up, hold up. I gotta, I gotta take a sip of tea first. All right, hillbilly time, guys. Ready? Watch. Watch. Hold up. Hold up. Wait. Right, get rid of the stupid headphones first. Here. All right. I don't know where they had problems. Okay. So. Actually, I get better with the headphones on. That's funny. All right. Hillbilly accent. Well, I declare... I just about broke one of my teeth trying to open this ketchup bottle. Sheeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeee
<laughs> oh my gosh. Alright guys, these goods are extremely fragile. Oh, there's a damage bar. You can't damage it. Okay, no problem. Okay, yep. Okay, that was damage. Dude, get away from me! Oh, they're taking all my money. I lost like $200 because of that ED. I should have shot him. Whoops. What? Birth and your son in the outhouse? <laughs> I guess that's one way to do it. Uh, I genuinely love the hat. Well, oh, that's nice. I'm glad you like it. I don't think I've worn this on the channel since like four years ago, if I'm being honest. Back when I did the Indiana Jones series. Trucking, country music, and a cowboy hat. It's perfect. Yeah? Yeah? I can't lie. It does kind of work. Cast move your body. No? No, I, I think I'm good, Sam. Thanks. <laughs> Alright. Hey, we, we, know how to, we know how to set the mood, at least. I'll give a set. Oh, crud. Okay, never mind. My tea's good. I thought I'd knock my glass over. I'm good. Mmm. Well, I do declare I went to the family reunion this year, and I'll tell you what, the girls were sure weren't as hot as last year. She, you know, that's that's how her always talk. Let's be honest. <laughs> Save this hat for Red Dead series. Oh yeah, that's not a bad idea actually. All right, Red Dead series. This would work for. Get some more compatible headphones for that, though. <laughs> oh man, I lost two hundred dollars because of that. I should have shot him. Towing me after I go to the store, right? Oh, I got a one star too. Hey, we're almost there. We're almost there, and we've still got at least seventy-five percent of the money coming to us. So you know what? I'll take it. I'll take it. Guess that's the head I was talking about for cosplaying. Oh, okay. Okay, Sam, that clears that up. Yeah, when you said cosplay, that kind of threw me for a, a loop. I was like, cosplay? What does he mean, cosplay? So... Eh, hold up. Hold up. Whoops. Shouldn't have done that. Okay. Forget the 75%, I guess. All right, five trucking missions complete. I got nearly 3K. I'll take it. At least we, at least we got her done. All right, so... If I remember correctly... We still have plenty more to go. I guess I'll go do a zero mission first, though. Yeah, let's go do another zero mission. Let's just hope it's not super hard this time. <laughs> oh, man. That's the type that goes to the family reunion to meet women. I know, right? I'll let someone else clip that, Lamal. <laughs> I had to screenshot it. Wow, Brett, Lamal, so true. All right, so, hat's coming off. Now, let's go back to regular CJ. You know what I need? I need, like, one of those gangster beanies or something. That would... That, that would that would fit well for Grand Theft Auto streams. <laughs> All right, guys. So let's continue on our way now, and uh, go do this zero mission. All right, I'm listening to some better music now. Like, don't get me wrong, that was fun and everything, but like, I kind of got a little tired of that. No, no more hard missions. I was too late, man. Is too okay. Fine, fine. I'll tell you what. We'll do a CJ mission first, and then, wait. Yeah, we'll do a CJ mission first, then a zero mission. How about that? There you go. Let's just hope it's not hard this time. Yeah, very famous last words, KJ1. Okay. All right, here we go, boys. Let's get it. What's the name of this mission? 555, we tip. Can't complain. I or guess I can. Say I wish you was here. Great. Now you got the present for that friend of mine, right? You know the one trying to get me and old Officer Pulaski into trouble. It's the cop. Yeah. Why don't you put that up in his car and give Wee Tip a call? Hey, motherfucker! The code of the streets is that I don't snitch. I don't give a fuck if he kills you, me, my brother. Street cats don't call no cops. Carl, he's a DA. Oh uh, yeah? Well, where I go find him? He's at the Van Kamp Hotel in the financial. Oh, for sure. Huh. 
Okay, sure. No, 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 you need a red or fedora. Yes, for real. The DA is on his way to Bank Hoff Hotel in downtown San Fierro. Get over there now. Let's do it. Go take out the DA, boys. It's one of my favorite missions. Cool, dude. KJ1's like, no, do a zero mission. We'll do the zero mission next, KJ1. Calm down, buddy. Calm down. Take it, KJ1. You, you gotta go outside, you gotta find your horses, and you gotta pick them up and hold them for a moment, okay, buddy? ASC plus TT100 says, hi, everyone. What's up, ASC? Welcome to the stream, dude. <clears throat> Sorry, guys. I don't know why my voice is so hoarse today. Probably just out of practice. <laughs> uh, I went, Let's see. I could see Kes introducing a stream like Cowboy Kes going, howdy. <laughs> Alex Schmidt, welcome. Kes, your voice sometimes reminds me of Soul from Breaking Bad. Really? That's funny. All right. wonder if Kess's long-distance relative was Minnie Pearl. I don't think so. I certainly hope not. Oh, man. Sounds like a fake number. It kind of does, doesn't it? Kess's phone vibrating? Yes. Yeah, my phone uh, vibrated a couple of times. Got a text message. Lily, that's what you were hearing. Some kind of wonderful. This doesn't even fit. Hold up. There we go. We're about to go, we're about to go cap somebody. This is like the, wait, wait, I'm an idiot. I didn't get any guns. I didn't get a single, we were, we went by the lot where our guns were and I still didn't get any. I'm an idiot. Dude, hold up, we gotta go back. I'm sorry guys, we gotta go back. We have to go back. Now nah, we're already here. Now let's, screw it, let's try it without guns. No guns, no guns everybody. The hotel operates a valet service. The DA will be dropping his, cough, bleh, dropping his car off here shortly. Follow the valet to the underground car park and waste him. Make sure no one is around. Okay. Gonna be kind of hard to do without a gun, but sure, let's do it. Valet is in the car park. Take him out while he's down there. No problem. Let's wait for him to uh, park the car first, I guess. Yeah, there he is. There we go. It was easy enough. Pick up the valet's uniform. Yes, I will, son. All right. Thank you. Sweet. Well, okay then. Get to the valet carport and wait with the other valets. Oh, wait with the other valets. Okay, I don't need to take the car with me, obviously. All right, we'll just walk up here. We're gonna look normal. Cass, I love that ASRM phone vibrating. No, no, you can't, you, can't, you can't do that. You don't need no guns? Sweet. Cass said that doesn't fit. That's what she said. <laughs> Seeing that cowboy hat makes me want to play Red Dead? Yeah, me too. Ah, you must be the new boy. Get in line. Will do, sir. DA is driving a blue Moret. Remember, it needs to identify it correctly when it arrives. Make sure none of the other valets service this car first. Okay, a blue Moret, guys. Shut up. Stinking dogs. All right, so that one's red. We're looking for a blue car, and it's a Moret. Is that a Moret? Probably not. All right, we're just gonna chill, boys. We're just gonna chill for a second. Who likes MMOG? I don't know what the stink that is. Yo, what is that song, bro? I don't know. Some song on the on the radio. Cash, you don't really need a gun for this mission. You, you're right. So far, I've yet to have needed a gun. Wait, is that it? That looks like it. Yeah, that looks like the car. What am I supposed to do with it, though? Maybe this wasn't it. Here, man, you can take it. I changed my mind. You, you can go ahead. Kess screwed up. Kess wrong car. I didn't screw up, dude. I, I realized quickly that was not the right car, and, and then he took it, so we're, we're, we're good. <laughs> All right. It's funny when you mess up a word in a sentence, you just say blah. Yeah, that is, that's just what I do. Mm. Oh, you slap your desk? Yeah. Blad's my reflex, slapping the desk is your reflex. I get that. 
Hold up. Is this it? That's not really blue. That guy looks a hell of a lot more like a DA, though. Is this it? Yes! You're in the DA's car. Get over to the garage where the drugs will be planted. Yes. Yes, I will, sir. All right, guys, here we go. A Jamaican song, cool. This is Jamaican? The last one was. I don't know. All right, anyway. I'll DM you an image of the car in the Discord. Not needed, dude. I figured it out. It's dark out there. Can you feel it? I can. Drugs are the only thing that will get us Thank you anyway, night. though. That and pills and the late night call to the therapist. Yeah, he's going to be wondering later. Where did where, where, where this car Where'd my car go? What happened to it? Mm. It was probably just stolen, dude. Wait, are we going to fit it with a bomb and take it back? Because that would be brilliant. I hope so. I hope that's exactly what we're doing. The drugs are planted. Oh, we're planting drugs. That's right. Take the car to the valet's car park. That's right. They actually said that. They said we were going to plant drugs, didn't they? Cast colorblind confirmed. I'm not colorblind, dude. This dut. You, you're wanted by the cops. Now your cover's blown. Dude. Oh, that's stupid. Come on. Oh. Well, we didn't have to restart very far back, so I guess it doesn't matter. <laughs> No, uh, I'm not colorblind, dude. This just does. This isn't what I would call blue. It looks more like gray to me. I mean, I guess it's a bluish gray, but see, that's blue. When I think of blue, I think of that. This just looks gray. It looks like this greenish, grayish, bluish color. Even that looks more blue. That's even a silver, I'm pretty sure. Does it look at all suspicious driving the car away from the valet station? <laughs> Uh, yeah, I probably could have been a little more subtle with it, huh, Doc? I don't think anybody noticed, though. I think we're good. Uh, <laughs> Dire Maker sounds like Jamaica? Does it really? Huh. Cass, it's black. This isn't black. This isn't even close to black. Park the car in the marked parking space. We'll do. What day is it today? I told you. Nice. Valet is coming to return the DA's car. Get outside the valet car park and call the cops. Let's do it. What's up, man? He looks like he's got ants in his pants. A little bit. Uh -huh. Oh, there's some cops right there. Hello? This wee tip? I seen something highly suspicious you should come check out. Nice. Time to get frames, son. Woo! Let's go. He's a DA, you know right? You're fucking with here? I'll have your badge, you moron. Shut up! You find anything back there? Found anything? He's got half of Mexico in here. Must be eh. two tons of Mary here. What? But but I've never seen. How could it be? Hell of a defense you got there, buddy. Wow. Bye-bye. GG, guys. Mission passed. Woo -woo. All right, what's up, man? Hey, Caesar. The Yay leaving San Fierro, right? Right, but they're using bikes, CJ, and they go cross country. Ooh. Okay, I'm going to see what I can dig up. All right, so this is my chance to go after one of the biker couriers, which I haven't done yet. So we're going to do that real quick. Uh, also, apparently we can come back here and do a valet mission, which is cool. I didn't even know that was a thing. So uh, we'll come back here and do that later next to this uh, pizza shop. But for now, let's go. Let's take this car and go uh, take out the motorcycle couriers real quick. All right, this is cool, guys. This is really neat. Uh, wait, where is he? Oh, he's over there. Yeah, we're gonna have to drive a good ways to get over there. But you know what? I think it's worth it. All right, Cole Key says, hey, what's up, Cole Key? All right, I bet your mom got good service, Brad. <laughs> wow. All right. You can now do valet as a side mission. Awesome. How many levels to valet are there for that? KJ1 says you've already done this mission. I've already done valet. 
Or do you mean I've already done bike courier? Because I haven't. I only did the vehicle courier. I didn't do the bike one. Cash if you beat the cock, which is for 100%. Right, I'm aware. Uh, last time I went to the starting area for that, it said I couldn't do it until later. Does that not... Was it once San Fierro is unlocked that you can do that? Because if that's the case, I'll go back and start that because that'd be another good thing to start. Alrighty, guys. Oh, hey, 20 likes on the stream. Thanks, everyone. All right, so wait, where'd he go? Oh, he went way back down here. All right, no big deal. He still catch up with them. All right. Mountain one is so annoying. The mountain one. The mountain uh, race. I can see that. You can always start it on weekends. That's true. But I do own a safe house right next to the beach where it starts. So it's not like sleeping for a while is that difficult. It's Wednesday right now. We'll wait a couple of days. We'll head down in that direction. We got plenty more to do until then. All right, I see him, guys. He's not too far away. He is off-road, though, so it's going to be tricky. I like this uh, vehicle I've got. It's decently speedy and easy enough to control, which is nice. Whoop, yep, we're good. Oh, I see him, yep. All right, boys, you ready for this? It's going off-road time. CJ off-road, wait, wow. Thanks for ruining it, idiot. Okay, wow, that's not what I want either. All right, you know what? That works. That works. Turn around. Turn around. There we go. All right, here we go, guys. Guess there's five levels of valet. Five levels. Okay. That'll be cool. We'll go ahead and go do that as well. Uh, first, though, I'm going to get this bike courier because, like I said, we haven't gotten a bike courier yet. It just hasn't even happened. So we got to go. We got to do it at least once. I mean, come on now. Any chance to get at Big Smoke's always, always a good idea. Oh, I see him. He's down here. I'm going to turn right real quick, catch up with him. Crap! Dang nab, but I got all turned around. Oh, I see him. There he is. There he is! Little stinker. Oh, crap. Crap again! Actually, kind of hard to keep up with him. Oh, wait, this is one of the things that has hydraulics on it. This is one of those gangster cars. No wonder it drives so well. Hey, look, one of those farm planes. That's cool. <clears throat> what the hell? What? What? Why? Why'd he just turn around? Instant Carver for saying it's good to handle. Yeah, I know, right? Uh, those five levels of Valway can be done in a row. Sweet, we'll do that. Get that done nice and quick. Well, crap. My gosh. All right, come on. Come on, move. Get him. There we go. Hold up. I'm going to run him over real quick. Yep, not today, buddy. No. Crap, I can't believe I missed. All right, that's okay. We'll get him this time. Oh, hey, we're back in uh, Los Santos now. That's fine. I wish I, I wish I thought to pick up a gun first before I went around doing this. I'll say that. Yeah, this would be so easy with an SMG. I could just knock him out nice and easy. I'm going to ram him here real good. Hold up. Oh, crud. Well, guess I was wrong, huh? Wow, get out, CJ. Oh, hey, I, at least I knocked him over. And now he's getting away again. Lovely. Can I get a car, please? Someone, anyone? This will work. This will work nicely. Get out. Get out, idiot. I need that shit you drive. <laughs> this is crazy. All right, idiot! Get out of my way! You morons! Move, you stupid car! Move! What is wrong with this thing? I don't know what was wrong with it. Okay, we, we're getting going again. Oh my gosh. Yeah, level 7 and 8 unlocks only when levels unlock. Oh, the trucking mission. You guys are talking about the trucking mission. Okay. Yeah, you can st I've only done five trucking missions so far, though, right? All right, let's go down here. 
Catch back up, Momentero. Wait, no! You idiot! I hate you so much, CJ! You incompetent baboon! <sighs> okay. Now I'm done throwing my temper tantrum. Just kill him. Oh, if it, yeah, why did I think of that? Oh! Idiot. All right, your mom gets all tuned, turned around. Yeah, I bet she does. She does how to turn around, let everyone represent. Oh, man. I'm gonna ram him good, goes off the hill. Yeah, that sounds about right. All right, here we go. This is what I need. Something to really crush him with. All right, thank you, sir. I will make good use of this track. All right, you boys ready to see this little worm get squished? So I'm ready to do some worm squishing. Perfect music for it, too. All right, let's go over here. This way. I know it's not the fastest vehicle, but it will get the job done. Just watch. Use that gamer rage as fuel. Eh. Yeah, for real. Oh, man. Pro tip, just drive on the road. Nah, screw that. Well, this is technically the road, isn't it? Yeah, I guess it is. All right, wow, it is foggy out here. Dang, son. Yes! Yes! I got him! Squish him! Squish him! Or not. There we go. The courier's losing stuff. Kill him before it's all lost. What do you mean losing stuff? Why is he smoking? Oh, we got him. Pick up the stuff. Let's do it. Let's do it, son. Stole 1863 from the courier. You can try again every Wednesday and Saturday. I don't need to, man. That was all I wanted to do. All right, guys. I just had to. I just had to do it at least once, right? <laughs> all right. So let's go back home real quick and get some more guns. Or actually, you know what? No. Let's go do another trucking mission first. We'll do another trucking mission. Then we'll get some more guns. Then we'll do another zero mission. It'll be great. All right. We got it, guys. Hey, Cass, would you ever be interested in doing like a game day with viewers, say like a party game, chill out day? Uh, we might do that at some point, sure. All right, go this way. CJ learning to drive. No wonder why Ryder calls him a buster. Yeah, I know, right? Oh man, Bob says I already made three quips so far. Good on you, Bob. All right, pro tip, get good. Another tip, drive straight. Guess starting to turn the dark side of the force. Yeah, sounds about right. Can you go back and read my mess? No, Lily, I can't. Just repost it. I can't scroll back up and try and find, pick your message out among all the various messages. Cole Key says, can you do a joke? Yeah, my love life. Ah! No, I'm teasing. I'm teasing. Okay. All right, here's a proper joke. Okay. Once upon a time, there was... I've told that joke already. Dang now, but what's a joke I haven't told? Let's think about it. Oh, I got one. I got one. All right. So there's a guy. Wait a minute. We got we got to put it. Hold up. We got to bring back Cowboy Kess for this story, okay? All right. So long time ago, I knew a fella out in the countryside who had a son, and they didn't know nothing about technology. They didn't know about computers or streaming or any of that. One day they decide they're going to go into town to sell some produce, right? Like farmers do. Well, by and by, they go into town and they walk into an office building and they see an elevator. Well, they weren't smart like your boy Kess. They don't know what an elevator is. So, they 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 just stand there. They just stand in there, right? And the son says to his dad, "Hey, what's that little room over there?" And his father says, "You know, son, I don't really know. Let me just sit here and watch it for a while. I'll figure it out. I'm a smart guy. You know, I can do that." So his son's like, "Okay, fair enough." So anyway, they're watching this little elevator, and to them, it just kind of looks like people are getting into a little room. The doors close, and after a few minutes, open back up. And new people get out, right? So anyway, this this fat lady gets in there. All right, you know, you know, you know what I mean by fat lady. I don't mean just like you know, pleasantly plump. I'm talking like Big Macs every day, down the gullet, warts everywhere. One of those types of women. She gets in the elevator, doors close, opens back up, round round, coming back out, right? 
Son looks at his father and says, so dad, have you figured out what it is yet? And he says, no son, but go get your mother. There's your joke. Okay, now that that nonsense is done, let's go ahead and do an actual trucking mission. All right, anyway. Uh, da, da, da. Guess don't forget about the bike boost. I did forget about the bike boost. Illegal goods to battery point, San Fierro. Let's do it. All right, when will we get the RDR series? Uh, much, much later in the future. Cass walks into a bar and the bartender here, says to him, Hey, why the long face? Short, I'm, not, I'm not a horse, hey, Brett. Baby, style, style. Hey, Cass, how I'm fat was she? I don't know, dude. It it's a joke. Four clips now? Uh -huh. Cannot stop the battery. I don't know what that means. Oh, dude. We've got three stars on this one. Oh, that's going to be rough. All right, that's okay, though. We got this. Cass, I can't believe that. Really, they didn't know what an elevator was? Sam, it was a joke, dude. It wasn't a real story. Cole Key said, tell a joke, so I told a joke. Okay, dude. This sucks. This is terrible. Ah! Oh, we're gonna, we're gonna get it. I'm trying my darndest to reattach this. But these guys are really not making it easy for me. All right, please tell me I'm about ready to catch, to reattach it. I only got about 30 seconds to try this again. Are you serious, dude? Turn the truck upside. Goodness sakes. Oh, are you serious? Now it's just the other way, moron. Oh, thanks, cops. Idiots. Guys, this is, like, ridiculous. What the crap? Oh, hey, I did it. Okay. And there goes the trailer, because that idiot over here is trying to drive his truck under it. And now my truck's on fire. Fine. Fine. Woo, hey, we. <laughs> Quite the little chain explosion. Really? I got no chance to restart from the point? Well, that's stupid. Ah, well, that was unfortunate, guys. Let's try that again, shall we? Guess I thought you were being for real. Oh, no. No, that wasn't a real story, dude. That was just a joke. Guy walks into a bar. He gets drunk, then he leaves. Sounds about right. All right. Anyway, let's go in here. Who knows Star Wars The Mandalorian? Oh, I've seen that show. It's pretty good. I love women. You don't love women. All right. Mm. Let's grab one of these. I'm just grabbing stuff we can't get uh, back at the garage in San Fierro. At least so we at least have weapons, you know? I'm tired of walking around with no guns. Uh, crap, I keep forgetting the controls. It's T to go back. Armor. Let's do that. Nice. All right, Brett says, hey, I gotta go. Take care and I'll catch you later. All right, Brett, it was good having you here, buddy. See you at the top. All right, Cat's gonna have trouble with level eight. Level eight of the uh, of the trucking mission, probably. Uh, weebles wobble, but they don't fall down. Is is that a fact, Doc? Oh man. So, Lily, what was it you were trying to tell me about the about the event on the beach? With speaking of which, what day is it now? Thursday. Okay, I knew I was in jail. For not jail, uh, hospital for a moment, so I was just checking. All right, let's go over here, do another trucking mission real quick. And, uh, we'll go back and do another zero mission after that. All right. I'm gonna, Cole Key says, I'm gonna go play Roblox. All right, have fun with that, Cole Key. Have a good one, dude. All right, there's two different ones, but only one is needed for the achievement. I did them both, though. Okay, good to know. I will probably do both of them as well. So, no reason not to. But good, I wonder why it's only one for the achievement. That's kind of weird. It's kind of like those collectibles, right? Where it's like 100 collectibles, but they give you an achievement for like 25 of them. It's like, why, why only for 25? Why not for the whole 100? Sometimes achievements are just kind of goofy like that. Okay, this is unfortunate. Uh, I'm just gonna chill in here for a second until that explosion finishes. Okay, the good news is, at least it opened up the fence. All right, let's try that again, guys. That was slightly embarrassing. All right. 
Cast, remember, you can't do the event until Lost Venturis unlocks. That was what it was. It was Lost Venturis. For some reason, I thought it was once San Fierro unlocks. But no, you're right, Sam. It did give me a message that said you couldn't do it until... Or no, it didn't even give me the message. It just wouldn't let me start, and I looked it up. And it said uh, it was a, a bug or some sort of issue, but... When it said that message, it meant you had to wait till Lost Ventures to unlock. So, yeah, I guess that's what we're doing. So we'll do that then. Alpha Nerd says, just beat GTA 5, my second favorite game of all time. Cool, man. What's your first favorite? Uh, da -da -da -da. Grab this. Roblox. Is Roblox even fun? Uh, I don't know. I don't really play it. I couldn't tell you. I guess, I guess some people enjoy it. I mean, less fun than Maximum Doom? Nah, I take that back. Maximum Doom is still Doom, so at least it's fun. For that reason. Oh, man. Alpha Nerd says Terraria. Oh, yeah, you've said that before, dude. I remember. You've told me Terraria was your favorite game. That's cool. And here's the stupid police again. Gosh! I wouldn't even care if it wasn't for the fact they were constantly disconnecting my freaking trailer. All right, here's what we're going to do. We're going to turn up here, and we're just going to go down this hill, and that'll be so much easier. All right, check it. We're just going to go slow. Okay, that was not easier, but it did work, so I'll take it. All right, we're good. We're good, guys. I'm doing it. I like this music, though, whatever the stink it is we're listening to. Yeah, it does. Just like your mom. <laughs> All right, let's go over here. Yep, they're waiting for me, weren't they? You can tell. Boom! See that? Where you ram them and it disconnects your trailer. That's what screws me up. I shouldn't have done that. Stupid cops. Should have just gone around them instead of trying to hit them head on. See, if it wasn't for that, I probably would have been fine. All right, let's see if I can reconnect real quick. Hold up. See, it's like ridiculously difficult to re... Oh, never mind. We did it. All right, here we go. Back on the road. Back up. How, how far do we have to go? Uh, not too far, but still a pretty decent distance. Why? I didn't... What the hell? There was no, there was no reason for it to disconnect that time. And now it's going to go in the water, right? Because of hill? Or maybe not. Like I said, there was no reason for it to disconnect that time. I wasn't, like, crooked or anything. Maybe, maybe, maybe it just got bounced to I don't know what the hell happened to it. I'll right, back it up. You're going to... Yeah. Okay, hold up. There we go. Okay. Turn around. Dude, no! No! Forward! I'm on this freaking hill and I'm having the hardest time getting away from it. Who the hell is shooting me? Oh, it's there. That's right. Hey, look, look. If I change the camera, it turns the audio of the. Oh, crap! Get out, CJ! Get out! Mission failed. Okay. At least he didn't die. That was what I was concerned with. Huh, so it doesn't, it doesn't offer to restart you like it does. Wow. Still couldn't kill him. There we go. Could kill her just fine. All right. Well, that was unfortunate, guys. But uh, I guess let's go back and try it again. That was rough. We almost had it, but we just took too much damage from the people in the helicopter. In the city. That's a good song. I like it. Uh, cats cannot control car. You get skilled in driving games. Nah, man. I'm great at driving in games. It's just that's hard. I'd rather play through Maximum Doom uh, than play one hour of Roblox or Fortnite. Oh, I did a completionist series on Fortnite too, dude. Yeah, that was not great. Maximum Doom was, well, is Maximum Doom more fun than Fortnite? At times, yes. At other times, no. Fortnite was actually kind of fun back in the day for a while. It wasn't great, but it was okay. Um, actually, according to GTA Wiki, the first Speed the Cock can be done before Lost Venturis, but there's a PC bug that tells you that you can't until then. Okay. 
Okay, it was it was something like that. I couldn't remember the exact reasoning, but yeah, for one reason or another, we couldn't do it till Los Venturas. All right, guys, let's give this another shot, shall we? All right, so we're starting. Ooh, we only have two stars this time. Okay, never mind. It took us back up to three. I was thinking, I was like, wait a minute. Is that a new little exploit? Is to start with a wand level and it'll start you lower? But no, it just, it, it knocks you back up to three. Easy enough. Tips how to get your friend to play a game. Harassment. Yeah, that works. Sometimes. Bob says they're going to be a stream tomorrow. If so, what will be on? There will be, and it will be a Golden Souls stream. So. Uh, there will be only one stream tomorrow, not two. But yes, it will be a Golden Soul stream. All right. Bob, it's not hard unless you're me. At least that's what Cass keeps on telling me. Because mobile sucks. <laughs> mobile does suck. Though. All right. Hold up. Move. There we go. All right. There we go. We got past. That's already... That already went far better than last time. If I can... If I... Okay, please don't move. No, don't do that. Don't tip over. Okay, we're good. I'm just gonna back up and go around them. Or, or they're gonna move for me even better. I like that. I, I can work with that. Yeah, this is working great. Cass's skills does mess with your driving. Or, excuse me. Cass's skills does mess with your driving. That's why you're having trouble with trucking. Wait, really? Wait. Oh, you're right. You're right, dude. I forgot. You actually meant, like, in-game skills. They're actually... My driving is decently high, but you're right. I guess if it was a little bit higher, I would do better. What not. I forgot about that. Okay. Psycho Monkey says I never got into Fortnite. Yeah, I played it back uh, around when I started the channel. I did Team Fortress 2. I did Indiana Jones, Lego, no, Lego Indiana Jones Adventures, that was what I did. And then I started doing Fortnite. I did both Fortnite Battle Royale and Fortnite Save the World. And Save the World was way better than Battle Royale, by the way. Way better. Alright, guys, this is going great. No helicopters so far even, really. Go kind of slow here, we don't want to screw it up. Alright, we're good. We're good. In fact, if anything else, they that just screwed up the cops. Yeah, truck's pretty good at moving everybody out of the way. Nice. That worked out awesome. I don't think that could have worked out better if I'd wanted it to. Eh. Six trucking missions complete. Let's go. Let's go, son. That was great. All right, so yeah, nice, nice try, guys. It's already delivered. I got my money. See ya. I'm having this. Uh, let's see. Psycho says something about oh, I'd love for Cast to play Dark Souls. Yeah, we'll do Dark Souls at some point. Yeah, I'd like to do uh, what were they? Let's see. There's Dark Souls, which is a trilogy. There's Demon Souls, Bloodborne, Sekiro: Shadows Die Twice. Oh, Taxi Man's coming back for revenge. What's the other one? Elden Ring, of course, the new one. Anyway, we'll have to get into those games at some point. All right, guys, how am I gonna how am I gonna get rid of Taxi Man? I'll tell you exactly how. Oh, he's gone now. Did he fall down the cliffs? Yes, he did. And so did I. Funny enough. You know what the difference is though? Cass lives. Taxi Man drowns. Yeah, that's what you get, Taxi Man. <laughs> okay. Well, that did not quite go how I want it to, guys, but what else is new? Let's swim over here to this dock real quick. Mm. All right, anyway, now that that's done, let's go back here and get some weapons, and then we'll go do another Zero mission. Uh, it's funny how you can just play this game for two hours and get so sidetracked by stuff. You only get a couple missions done. Oh, wait, we were going to do Valet. We'll do Zero mission first and then do Valet, I guess. Gas price here is higher than most NFTs. Wow, dang, man. All right. KJ1 says, tip, if you're feeling adventurous, you should, you should consider driving into an ocean. 
Since police will follow you to the ocean. Good to remember, KJ1. Crap, what the hell? Wait. Crap. I shouldn't have... Okay. That's on me. I shouldn't have tried swimming while I was pouring a glass of tea. Oh, man. Tip, if you hate your wife, nuke your state slash country. What the hell, Bob? All right. I think the cops just give up once you get there. Yeah, they're just like, oh, well, he got there. Never mind. Can't do nothing about it now. It's kind of, oh. Oh, yes, that's right. Ladders don't actually work, do they? I don't understand that. What's the point of them being here if they don't work? And where's a boat when you need one? For goodness sakes. How am I going to get out of here? Mafia 1 still the king? Is it now? All right. Cops be like, dang, he delivered the stuff. No evidence against him. Gotta let him, him go. Yep. Uh, well, Cats loves driving off cliffs. Yeah. Can't wait for the GTA San Andreas Caves and Cliffs update. Mm. Cats, fun fact, you can't climb ladders. I know, right? Why is that? Why is it the thing? Like, I can swim, which is nice, but I can't climb ladders. Pity. Oh, well. Let's try again. Fun fact, you can eat. Nah, I'm not eating. I got to, I'm trying to lose some fat and some muscle so that I will be uh, more universally appealing to the ladies, if you know what I mean. Mafia remaster was amazing. I heard that. I heard that the Mafia 1 remake was good and the Mafia 2 remaster was bad. I'm just not exactly sure why. I want to say I watched a video interview about Andrew the Giant. I don't know who that is. At this point, you may as well drown yourself, Lil. Well, that's a terrible thing to say, Lily. What an awful... Why would Lily want me to drown... Why well, you want me to fail the mission earlier? I guess you're just some sort of sadist. All right, it's okay. I will make it. I will persevere. I bloody hope. Gosh! How do we get out of this stupid water? Wait a minute. I think there's a boat over here. Yeah, I'm, I'm almost 100% sure there's a boat over this way. All right, we'll go try to find the boat. Kes, thanks for acknowledging my improper typing and saying what I was intended instead of what I wrote. No problem, dude. You do YouTube long enough, you get used to that. You get used to having to translate people's comments. Kes is taking the long way. Do you know a shorter way, Sam? Would it have been better if I swam the other direction? I think he meant Andre the Giant. Well, I don't know who that is either. Sadist? That's a funny pronunciation. Are they pronounced sadist? Is that what it is? It's like I always say, why pronounce things properly? When you cannot. Cats go the other way, it's shorter. Well, it's a little late for that, buddy. You want me to turn, like, all the way back around? I was hoping there'd be a boat here. Uh, at least my stamina's upgrade. I guess that's something to be thankful for. Uh, is there, like, a way I can get to the... No, I don't want to turn around. Wait a minute. Uh, no. No, I'm going to keep going. All right, my stamina is going up. I guess I guess that's good. All right, no problem, guys. We're actually swimming a little faster, I think. Oh, wait, don't I have unlimited stamina? I do have unlimited stamina. Oh, so the stamina skill doesn't really mean anything, then. Eh. Cass hasn't seen the Princess Bride. Sakura's, yes, I have. I've seen the I've seen the Princess Bride several times. The movie's great. Uh There's a boat. Oh, it's a boat. Come here. Please, please, please. Please come here. Why am I drowning? Why am I drowning? Come back. CJ, there's a bloody boat, sir. There is a bloody boat, sir. Please bring me your boat just a little bit. Just a little bit. No! Come near me! No, don't turn around that way! Come on! We'll make some beautiful music! It'll be great! CJ, stop doing that, you idiot! Come on! Come on, no boats! Please come back, boats! Please, they're, dude, they're leaving me behind! The boats are leaving me! What the hell? Do you know who Andre the Giant is? Oh! Oh, oh! Okay. You're talking about the, the really big guy who was, uh... Yeah, that guy. Okay. Yeah, he was cool. He was a cool guy. Oh, man. Yeah, that was neat. All right, I'm kind of done with the wild boat chases. Oh, a police boat! Hey! Here, if I shoot at them, will they come for me? Hold up. Can I shoot at them? I don't think so. Wish I could. Nope. Nope, trying to shoot just makes me dive. 
Sad. Alright, guys. Let's keep going. We're almost near land, I think. Cass, go under the water because you're going to need to up your one capacity for 100%. Oh, that's a good, that's a good point, dude. That's it. Oh, there's a shark! There's a shark. That looks dangerous. That looks like something that could eat your boy pretty good. If I wasn't careful. Uh, oh, excuse me. Hey, at least we're going a little faster now. I think. Probably not. Mm. Alright, we're almost to land though, so that's good. Oh, boat is playing with Cass. Yeah, it sure is. The boat came to you just to taunt you. Nice. Yep. Lung capacity is actually very small. Alright, let's go down. We can go underwater a little bit. It won't hurt us much. Fun fact, you can't swim and shoot. Just like Saints Row, sadly. What a pity. Boat's doing donuts in front of CJ to mess with his head. Everybody just hates CJ for some reason. I don't know why. CJ seems like a perfectly upstanding fellow. Don't you agree? What can you do? <laughs> <coughs> Alright, is this too steep? This looks awfully steep. Maybe. I might have to go over there, but we'll try it. We'll try it right here. I think we can get out here. Yeah, here we go, guys. There we go! Finally! Oh, that was infuriating. Oh, man. And just because just I'd attack, check to see if Crazy Taxi Man drowned. On the bright side, he did, so. Oh, don't worry, man. I'm gonna I'm gonna take out the cops, too. Well, probably not. All right, I'm out. See ya. Bye, Grandma. Grandma's dead. All right, where are we going? Uh, yeah. Back there, okay. All right, guys. Back to San Fierro. Back to weapons. Back to, uh... Whatchamacallit. Back to some zero missions. Why you shouldn't do long capacity if you want to see an alternative cutscene. Oh? Really? Is it like one of those things where you where you're fat and big smoke tells you to lose weight? I mean you wouldn't pick up a guy randomly swimming in the waterway in the middle of the night. <laughs> yeah, I mean who wouldn't do that? I totally would. In a heartbeat, I would be like, oh hey man, you need to be picked up? Because I'm nice. Just teasing, especially a guy with the silence pistol. Like, why not? Oh, apparently I can't break that fence. All right then. Probably for the better. I would have fallen in the water again. Had to start all over. That would have been awful. Uh, I probably would have just drowned at that point. Probably wouldn't have had the heart to do it all over again. Officer Tenpenny got those boats to do some trolling just to taunt CJ. Probably. He was probably like, oh, CJ's swimming for his life. Quick, man, get out the boats. That's probably exactly what he said. Finally. I know, right, Okanda? Welcome to stream, dude. Oh, man. All right. Zero mission time? Yes, it is, Draven. It is absolutely zero mission time. All right. Hold up. I was trying my darndest to get back over there, but it wasn't worth it. I'll just get out here and walk. Let's just do that. You know, just face plant in the concrete. Nothing wrong there. And that'll go in the tracks. The train will get it. Good deal. Anyway, what's up, man? Get destroyed. Oh, never mind. Never mind. Forget I said anything. All right, finally, some decent weapons. Okay. So now that that's done, let's go ahead and save real quick. Good enough. Hey, uh oh. Sup? The cash is leaving Los Santos again. Nope. Go Not interested. Slide, man. Got too much shit on my plate. I think that means it's Saturday, though, right? Yeah. No, it's Friday. Okay. If I had uh, Lost Venturis unlocked, I could go do that event. Yeah. Well, won't worry about it for now. Let's just go and do Zero's mission. Funny enough, the cop didn't see me because he had his back turned. That was funny. All right. Uh, Cash, yeah, it's like the fat phone calls, but instead of a phone call, you get a cutscene. Oh, okay. Cool. So, the last zero mission. Good stuff. I've been enjoying this game so much, guys. It's like Vice City. You know, I, I had a great time with Vice City, but there's like way, way more content in this than there's Vice City. Or at least it certainly feels that way.
What's it's a bigger map zero? too. I'm off to engage with destiny, good or bad. What the hell are you talking about now? The hour of judgment is upon me, and I must ask myself if I am a sheep or a goat. <laughs> Carl, will you be my second? Here are some letters. I've left everything to you in case I don't make it. Please. Already own it. What's wrong with you, man? We are crossing the Rubicon. <laughs> He's right. I, am too I forgot about that. With Berkeley, at stake, honor. And our very lives. It's funny. I've never noticed before how beautiful this time of year can be. Wow. I may never again see Rome in the springtime. Rome? Butterfly. Come on with all the talking, man. Is you gonna battle Berkeley or what? It's a fight to the death. Come here. I love how practical CJ is with like literally everything. Behold, no man's land. Man, y'all take this shit seriously. Berkeley's headquarters wow. is across no man's land. I'll drive the bandit, you fly the goblin, and help any way you can. If I get the bandit into Berkeley's base, he <laughs> must leave San Fierro for good. Let's wow. Wow. This is incredible. Your goblin helicopter is fitted with a magnet which can pick up objects. Not with me, dude. Press and hold this to increase the rotor speed. Ah, okay. To help propel it forwards, cool. Use WASD to tilt it in the direction you wish to maneuver it in. Okay, and then we use the magnet to pick up this. Oh, we want to pick up the uh, the barrel. That makes sense. And then we want to move that. Then we can drop it again. That makes sense. Okay. So this is like basically like a little obstacle course, essentially. Why can't I just pick up the car and take it with me? Berkeley's Goblin will constantly try to block the path of your bandit. Oh, I see. That makes sense. All right, so we just we got to clear the way ahead. That makes sense. Here, we'll, we'll do some good old water pollution. Hold up. There you go. There's some water pollution. All right, uh, press and hold this to decrease the rotor speed. It'll bring it down towards the ground. Carl, don't be an idiot. Use the Goblin to move that barrel. Oh, maybe I should put the barrel in between. Yeah, hold up. Hold up, so then... Our base and make a bridge across that gap. Oh, a plank. That makes more sense. Okay. Then the then the stinking barrel. Okay, this is cool. This is a cool little mission. All right, this is kind of a fun mission. I like it, Lily. It's different. It's really cool. Uh, the always lovable David Cross. His call into Lonely Hearts on WCTR is hilarious. I need to go back and listen to that again. Uh, Jack Eugen says, I want to say, if you need a game to survive, tell you Manhunt 1 you need to try... At some point, we're going to do all the various Rockstar games, dude, which will include Manhunt. All right. Anyway, we're just, you know, playing through the Grand Theft Autos right now. So, um, at some point, once we finish, like, the mainline Grand Theft Auto games, right? And all the, and well, not just the mainline ones, but wait. Oh, how do I, wait. How do I pick up the plank? Do I use the magnet? Dude. How does this work? Wait. No, go back for a plank. I don't I don't know how to I don't Yeah, I did go back. The planks just blow around. <laughs> what the hell? Third eye, welcome to the stream, dude. He says Happy Wheels theme intensifies. I know, right? Oh, so how's the So how so that's how the barrels of nuclear waste got in the ocean GTA 5. That's exactly how. I just noticed those decorations on the ceiling had the Rockstar logo. I know, it's a cool Easter egg. It's easy if you don't pick up the barrels and take everything else out first before doing the barrels. Ah, okay. I didn't know that. Take your time. You have plenty of time in this mission? Okay. Ignore the tank since the tanks don't work. Oh, okay. Really, you can't compare the old GTAs to San Andreas just because of the content and gameplay mechanics now. If they had a remake you compared, it's the same for music. Yeah, I mean, you're right. The, the amount of content, like, they got on it. San Andreas was really the first mainline GTA game, I feel like, that, like, actually was, like, super compelling in all the right ways. You know what I mean? All right, guys, how do I pick up a plank? I have no idea how to pick it up. Do I get out? Do I hit exit? There's always one lazy soldier who lets the whole side down, isn't it, Carl? Oh, no, that just failed it. Oh, no, I was trying to exit the helicopter, so I go and pick... How do you get a plank? Is it is that a bug? Nobody kn that's a bug? Oh, everybody's laughing about it. Oh, well, Mal, that's hilarious. That's just a bug. 
Oh! Oh, it's not supposed to do that. Oh, that's funny. Oh, man. Uh, so you're going to play Manhunt? Yeah, at some point we will. Oh, that's funny how government thinks social distancing would work. Uh, that's a great bug. It is. That's crazy. Well, maybe it'll be fixed now that we restart it. Oh, man. You know when you tell me the old team was fired and the new team doesn't make good work? Yeah, at Rockstar. I don't, I don't know if they were fired. I don't think anybody ever said that. I think it's just over time the demographic of the company has changed. Plus, it's just bigger now, you know? Dave, Dave Hauser left. That's probably a good sign. Can I recommend restarting? Yeah. Yeah, you're right. You can place the planks and everything down Behold. first before moving the first barrel. No okay, we'll do that this man, time. Take this shit seriously. Berkeley's headquarters is across no man's land. I'll drive the bandit, you fly the goblin, and help any way you can. If I get the bandit into Berkeley's base, he must leave San Fierro for good. Let battle commence! Okay, so I think there's like a couple of different planks, if I'm not mistaken. Huh, and now it's just fine. Well, sort of. Okay, or not. Okay. I got one of them anyway, so hopefully that's enough. <laughs> uh, okay. So let's go. Here, we're gonna just go down, press and hold. There you go. Alright, so that's done. Let's see if we can pick up another one without it going crazy. Mm. Alright. Psycho Monkey says, I miss the old rock star. Yeah, I know what you mean. Okay, one of them's spinning around. Oh, and that's kind of irregardless of whether I'm here or not, too. The problem is it makes the other one spin around as well. Here, we'll get close and get one with the magnet. Come on. Come on, dude. Dude, these planks. Dude, seriously, this is stupid. Give me a freaking plank. Carl, don't be an idiot. Use the goblin to move that barrel. It's not the barrel, dude. It's the stupid plank. Yes. No. No, I messed it up. Okay. Okay. Come here. Carl, I'm blocked. Okay, we don't care, dude. Take a laxative and shut up. Oh, dude. I pick it up and then I drop it. Okay, I keep spam clicking it to try and get it. There you go. I got it. cursed barrel in the way. Okay, it's okay, dude. Let it go. All right, so. Let's get the plank. Move it. Carl, Berkeley's blocked me again. Okay, I don't care, dude. Go whine about it to your kindergarten teacher. All right, here we go. Curse you, Berkeley. Carl, move that barrel. Nice. All right, now we can move the barrels, thankfully. All right. <laughs> anyway, you can place the planks and everything down first before moving the first barrel, right? Same way you pick up the barrel, yeah. We got it. Planks are made out of metal. I guess they are, yeah. Oh, man. Robo Weisson, welcome to the stream, dude. He says, oh, goodness, not Zero's missions. Those missions made me absolutely mad. The Carl, second one made me kind of mad, too, dude. But the first and third one aren't, aren't so bad. At least not in the Definitive Edition, anyway. I, I don't know about the original. All right. I'm blocked. Whoops. There we go, dude. Keep going. All right, we'll move that. What else is there? Let's see. We got, I think we got another barrel. Goblin will constantly try to block the path to the bandit. I got that. Hold up. Whoops. Uh-oh. Hold up. There you go. I got it. All right, so that's moved. We'll move these two next. Nice. Move that. This is really a funny way to settle a dispute, but I mean, hey, they're, they're kind of nerdy. Let's be honest. How else are they going to do it? Berkeley's using tanks. All right, we got five Go, minutes. Grab a bomb and get rid of any tanks that threaten our progress. You guys said the tanks don't work in Definitive Edition. Is that true? Why would, why would you not have the tanks work? I think KJ1 said that, didn't he? Probably. All right, let's pick this barrel back up real quick. Eh. Move this out of the way. Huh, he's right, the tanks don't work. Oh, never mind, it does. Taking damage from a tank. Use bombs your base to attack. So you were uh, mistaken, KJ1. The tanks do work in the Definitive Edition. 
Oh man, look looking like Carmageddon mod with how erratic the planks are. Yeah, for real. Oh man. Doing it this way makes it so much easier apart from the bug you've seen have. Mm-hmm. Yes. Rockstar still makes good games. Red Dead Redemption 2 is really, really good. I think it's take two more than them. Man, you're probably right. Alright, anyway. Uh, da, da, da. It was probably made harder by the fact I was playing the remastered edition on the 360. Yes, that would definitely make it uh, harder. Hell of a lot buggier, that's for sure. Alright, anyway. Rockstar Games lost their balls. They used to be the rebellious yet quality company. Now they don't even hide it. That they want their money and their out-of-touch investors' approval. It's true. It's very true, KJ1. You are right about that. I mean, you know, it's like GTA Plus, right? Like, nobody wants that. It's it's just stupid. Nope, nobody is asking for that. So, that's really what it is. At some point, you just become out of touch with your demographic, which sucks, but... Eh, what, what can you do, right? Alright, hold up. I'm gonna get this tank real quick. Now, he's, he keeps trying to move. Hold up. Nice. Other objects can also be dropped on tigers. Oh, crap. Did my goblin blew up? What? You have two remaining? That's funny. Is there another tank I can drop a bomb on? Let's go check. I'm gonna take one with me just in case. We don't want the bandit to get destroyed. Alright, we got three minutes left, guys. Let's go. Let's go, baby. Guess the tanks only work if they see the RC cars. Okay. I'm gonna try just in case. Uh, Bandit's taking damage from a tank. Right, exactly. Oh, I guess I didn't really need to move that, did I? I do need to move this, though. This is gonna need to be moved. Alright, three minutes, boys. Three minutes. Let's go. Nice. Move that. This is such a cool little mission, I can't even lie. Honestly, besides the one with the airplane and destroying the cars, I don't mind Zero's missions. They're actually pretty fun. Okay, I need another bomb. Oh, dude, I hope that doesn't destroy the bandit. Hold up. I didn't see that other tank is the problem. Oh, man, I hate Take Two because they're just Buster. Jack, is, is everything Buster to you, dude? Come on now. Man's taking damage from the tank. Yeah, I get it, man. I'm gonna get the bomb and go back. Don't worry about it. All right, here we go. Very entertaining stream, though. Hey, thanks, man. I'm glad you're enjoying it. So, don't have any homework, so I can just chill. Awesome. F to that goblin. F to that goblin. <laughs> oh, man. All right, here we go, guys. Nice. Well, trying to, anyway. Nice. And what happens if I drop it on his goblin? Like, let's just say, for a moment, I knocked it with a barrel. What would happen? Probably nothing. There we go. There we go, son. Get destroyed, Berkeley. Ah. Woo! Ah. Berkeley, ha -ha. you, sir, are a loser. Losery loser face. Up your crummy mail order business and get out of my town, Carl. You yeah! A like me could want in a second. Sir, I salute you. Nice. GG, guys. Asset acquired. Let's go. Zero RC. Property will now generate revenue up to a maximum of 5,000. Make sure you collect it regularly. It's just like my city all over again. And we got 7,000 for that, too. That was so fun. I enjoyed that, guys. Cass, what's GTA Plus? I don't really know, lol. Oh, I made a video about it going into more detail if you want to check it out. Uh, but just to sum it up real quick for you, it's like a subscription service for Grand Theft Auto Online that gives you discounts um, on like different mission and business upgrades and then like 500,000 in-game currency a month. That's it. <laughs> oh, man. All right. There was going to be more RC missions for Zero, but they decided to cut it. There was one with a tank and one with an RC race. Oh, that's too bad. Those were fun. I enjoyed them a lot. Steve says, how's everyone doing? I'm doing great, man. My voice is a little hoarse, but other than that, not too shabby. Berkeley got wrecked. Yes, he did. Finally, you win. I know, right? Cash, you can kill his goblin, but it's super hard to do. Mm. All right. Steve says, doing good. Just making a Windows install device for when I'm done building my PC. 
just waiting for my cooler to arrive. Awesome, Steve. So here's the important question, dude. Are you going with Windows 10 or Windows 11? <gasps> you need to go to save the game now. I do. I do, Jack. You were correct, buddy. All right, so what we're going to do real quick, guys, is we're going to save the game. We are going to go buy all the rest of the safe houses in San Fierro. And then we're going to go do that new valet uh, little side mission. And then we'll come back here and do this next CJ mission. KJ1 says, hell yeah, now I can get a discount by purchasing the discount. I know, right? It's so stupid. It's like the dumbest thing imaginable. It's like, it's like I pointed that out in the video. I'm like, who's buying this? I mean, I could, I could see it maybe being a booster for new players, but established members of the game aren't going to use that. They don't they don't need it. You know what I mean? It just doesn't make any sense. Besides, I've always been the, I've been someone who likes to like progress and grind things out instead of just buying my way to the top. But then again, you know, I've never played a game. I've never really done a series on a game where buying your way to the top is necessary. Maybe if I actually was playing a game like that, I'd feel differently, but I don't. All right, well, this is an interesting little apartment. Hey, check out the trash back here, too. Dang, son. Got some flies buzzing around. Nice, nice. All right, 40K, let's do it. Ooh, that is a nice garage. Look at all the cars we put in that bad boy. All right, we still owe well over a million dollars. GTA Plus sounds awesome. We'll sign up right now. Thanks for the heads up, guys. Nice, Doc. Well, he says, I think, I kind of think Rockstar is different for the same reasons Saints Row is different. Yes, I agree with you, Willie. It's people come and they go. This mission reminds me of a mobile game I played as a kid. It's about playing with an RC drone and moving stuff around with it. That's cool, man. They made sense within that era, and we're able to do good things that felt good back then. But that tone is not something that we feel like we want to do today. We have a different kind of story we want to tell. Yeah, it's just, it's really just... People have changed over time. There's different people. It's a different time period. You know, and here's the thing. I don't really care for the new direction of most of these companies. But I feel like I'm a fair person who, who's give, who gives stuff a chance. You know what I mean? It's like the new Saints Row. I don't think it looks as good as the older ones. But I'm still going to play it and do a series on it and give it a shot. So. And then if it sucks, I can tell you guys that. And then that's it. Uh, all right, 50K. Let's go. Need to buy the property. Hotel suite purchased. Wow, so we actually own a hotel now. What, what does the inside look like? I'm curious. Whoa. That is awesome. Dude, this is cool. I mean, it's only one room, but still. 500,000 a month is a joke. You can make millions a day. I said the same thing, dude. You're completely right. All right, let's turn around. I must say, some visuals of the Definitive Edition look really good. They do. They do. I do like the way some of the things look in the Definitive Edition. Like, they screwed up a lot of stuff, but some things look really good. Add to that, I'm playing with a graphics mod that improves the fog and the lighting and whatnot, so that helps, too. All right, so we've got three more safe houses to hit. Era hit. <laughs> to buy. Excuse me. Then we'll go do that next valet mission and uh, come back around and do the next CJ mission. Should be a happening time. Money talks, merit walks, yeah. You are not wrong, my friend. Windows 10 for now, Cass. Maybe in the future I'll upgrade to Windows 11. Good deal, man. That's kind of where I'm at right now, too. I love Windows 11. I would upgrade to it in a heartbeat if it was stable enough to do everything I want to do. But it's just not. Too much stuff crashes too often. OBS crashes, GTA crashes, Apex Legends crashes. A lot of stuff crashes on Windows 11. If it wasn't for all the freaking crashes, I would totally use it, because it's it's good. It'll probably be better in the future. Buy to the top live? There you go, Lily. There you go. We need a buy to the top live. <laughs> Nobody needs that. What's up, man? The Yay leaving San Fierro, right? Right, but they're using bikes, CJ, and they go cross country. This crap right again. Nah, fam. Some shit. Yeah, I don't want no, no, no more of your courier missions. Buy the property. Let's go, son. All right, so we bought that property. So we got two more to go, including one down here. All right, 
Do the infinite white. Hey, Gustavo Chato, welcome to the stream, dude. He says, do the infinite, infinite life code. Now, I'm not doing that, dude. I don't use cheats on uh, Grand Theft Auto. I just play regular. Wouldn't it be funny if GTA Plus was a streaming subscription service where you can watch GTA cutscenes over and over again? That would be hilarious. But completely unnecessary. Actually, I'm glad that's not the case, because if they were doing that, they'd probably start going after YouTubers and trying to start DMCAing stuff. Take Two is just retarded. I'm sorry. They really are. It's mostly time content behind GTA Plus. They already said some DLC stuff would be in it before the public gets it. Right, right. Which is, uh, you know, that's to be expected, I guess. But really, if that's all it is, it's kind of like, you know, I can, I can wait for everything else. There's plenty to do in the meantime. What do you think about some games Rockstar made in the past and they forgot about them and some older games? I mean, hey, if I'm just saying, I, I don't run a video game company, but if I did, I would want, I would think you'd want to keep on putting out good titles in your series as much as possible and not rely on just one or two IPs. But I don't know, you know? 100,000, that's expensive. This better be a nice stinking apartment. I think we're down below a million dollars now. And no, KJ1, before you ask, I'm not going back to the casino. All right. Gustavo doesn't use cheats. Yes, you were correct, Sam. All right. Anyway, Chicken Under License is way better than GTA Plus. Mm -hmm. And that subscription isn't even a subscription, but a one-time purchase. Exactly. GTA runs good on Windows 11 for me. Does it? Awesome, dude. I'm glad to hear that. Your mom crashes on Windows 11. She probably does. Oh, fancy. What a fancy bit. Guys, check this out. This is snazzy. Actually, I've, I think I've had, bought a building like this. There's Chinese food in the kitchen. Oh, I wish I hadn't said that. Now I have a weird craving for Chinese food, which is not what was there, by the way. All right. Da, 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 da. Put out good titles. What kind of radical business plan is that? I'm just saying, man. Here's, here's the thing, right? I love Grand Theft Auto, right? It's an excellent series. And it's amazing. And I am going to play through all the Grand Theft Auto content I can get. That being said, if they stop this series and they never made anything else related to Grand Theft Auto ever again, I would be okay. Because there's tons of other great games out there. You know what I mean? There's just so many of them. So it's just, it's just kind of not that big a deal. <laughs> you know, it would be okay. I just hope that doesn't happen. I hope Grand Theft Auto keeps getting... Uh, keeps continuing to, to get cry. good games. I want to cry. GTA 5 this actually requires really you to use cheats to unlock a secret mission involving Michael J. Fox. Really? Huh. Like well, I'd feel differently if it was something like that. You know, that's using that's that's different than just you know using a cheat code just for the hell of it. In fact, for that matter, I don't even think. Well, okay, I take that back. I was gonna say I don't think there are cheat codes in the Definitive Edition. But that's not true. There's just certain ones that are missing, I, I think. All right. Anyway, GTA Plus feels like spending a skill point to increase headshot damage by 10%. Oh, he's he's taking my car and parking it in the garage. Oh, that's funny. Or no, he's not, because somebody else is in his way. Eh. GTA 4 made me buy a PS3. That's funny, Psycho Monkey. Saints Row 1 made me buy an Xbox 360. Uh, anyway... I wish GTA 1 and 2 get uh, remade or remastered. That'd be great. That would be awesome. Yeah, I would play them again if they did. Yes, yeah, since it requires you either have a week where every day's morning is either snow or cloudy, which is practically impossible to occur. Wait. Wait a minute. KJ1 says it requires you to have a week where every day's morning is either snow or cloudy, which is practically impossible to occur. It would be, wouldn't it? Well, we committed Grand Theft Auto, literally. He did. He did. Except that he's a valet, and he's not very good at it. <laughs> get a valet uniform to work as a valet. I probably should have expected that. All right, get out of my car, loser. I'm going back to my house. Closest one here, actually. Just run that guy over. I mean, who gives a steak, right? Oh, pizza store. Oh, I got a one star. Oh, it went away. Never mind. Out of curiosity, how's my fat looking? It's still pretty... It's, it's low, but not low enough. Eh... That's one way to drive a car, isn't it? Here, let's just get out of it. CJ, get out. There we go. I was pressing the escape key, but I guess the car needed to stop first. 
All right, let's go up here real quick. See me. I I did just see you, and, and I didn't like what I saw. Sup, <laughs> Kess? What's up, Sandwich? Welcome to stream, buddy. From what I hear, GTA 6 is coming within 2024 to 2026, and they're going to release a trailer at the end of 2022. Here is why I think Grand Theft Auto 6 will come out in 2025. You guys want to hear my theory? You don't? Okay, too bad. You're going to hear it anyway. San Andreas, there was three years before it came out and GTA 4 came out, right? And so then GTA 4, there was six years. The number doubled. Six years between it and GTA 5. So it would only make sense that the number would double again to 12 years. And 12 years after 2013 is 2025. And that's why we'll have GTA 6 in 2025. I know, I'm a genius. So, anyway, let's uh, let's go change into our valet uniform, shall we? Saints Row 1 made me buy an Xbox 362. That's cool. Honestly, it's really the only game I've played on it that I've since I've owned it, I'm pretty sure. Valet uniform. There we go. Good deal. His hands look weird to me. Does his hands look weird to anybody else? All right, so now that's done. We got our valet uniform on. Got this cool little necklace. We're going to go ahead and head back out to the valet mission. And let's go out here. There we go. All right, Xbox 360 was awesome, but all we wanted was the Xbox 720. <gasps> the Xbox 720. Imagine. Oh, uh, let's go ahead and pick this car up real quick. There we go. Thank you, sir. And before you ask, no, I don't give a stink that the police saw that. I don't even give a little bit of a stink. I don't care in the slightest. Because I can just do that, and boom, I got away. What are they going to do about it? Nothing! Kes pulling out the mask. I know, right? Kes got a big, big brain. Absolutely. Totally wasn't my brother's idea that I'm holding all the credit for. Not at all. Oh, she wants it. She, 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 wants, she wants her car parked in the valet, too, apparently. Yep, ha have fun. Oh, he, he's, he's basically pushing her over in order to... I'm, I'm sure you do. I don't really want to fight you, though. I, I just work here, lady. No. Go away, Karen. Valet parking. Let's go, son. May I take your order? Park three cars in two minutes. Let's do it. Let's do it. Valet mission level one. Level one, son. Sit the stink down, Grandma. Damage bonus 42. The hell's a damage bonus in this context? I don't know. Uh, quite a lot if you think about it. It is. It's a lot of time. The only reason I got a PlayStation was because of Spider-Man. Yeah, I feel that. I got a PS4 for, uh, various Sony games as well. Which is funny because not only are they starting to port their games to PC now, I've barely used it. So, we will, though. At some point, because there's some various games I want to play in the future that are still... Oh, he's, he's just jogging in place while I do my job. That's nice. Keep up the exercise, buddy. Uh, anyway, what was I talking about? Oh, yeah. There's still some games I want to stream and do a series on the channel that, unfortunately, are still only on PS4. So, yeah. Whoa, Karen. She was, though. She was nothing but a straight-up meth head Karen. For real. All right. Time left. Cars to park. No problem. We got this. Me having social interactions be like... Yeah, right? Doc says she definitely wanted you to park something. Oh, don't don't say that. Don't ever say that. I fight like an animal. You know, it's like, it's like I'm over here like, well, dude, there's, I, I never had any doubt, but I mean, still, what does that got to do with me? Oh man. Guess fun fact: if your car dis dis bleh, your car despawns. You can find it at a cop impound station, so don't worry if you want a car and it despawns, it's been impounded. So you can get a cop car and go to the impound and get it. Oh, that's good to know, Sam. I didn't know that, dude. Thanks for the info. You received a $100 tip. Nice. Not bad. Valley mission, level one, passed. Park far, <laughs> park far, park four cars in two minutes. There's a car waiting to be serviced. I'm sure there is. Another valet picked up the waiting car. 
I probably need to start uh, driving parked cars back up here and then in, to, in order to get the time down, right? I imagine, probably, yeah. Okay, ah oh, yes, parking in the vehicle depot. If you take time in parking, you will get extra time. Oh, oh, that's good to know, okay. Parking bonus, three seconds. Damage bonus, plus 44 seconds. Oh, you're right, you're right. I don't need to drive up here to reduce the time. I just get time bonuses. My Windows install device is done. Congrats, Steve. I'm excited for you, dude. Getting your own PC. You're gonna have some fun, I bet. All right, no! Get out, get out of my car. Idiot. All right, I'll take this one instead. No, come back, please! I just wanna service you. Oh, okay. Apparently, I convinced him. Could, could you, I didn't think that would work. I didn't think it was that easy. I just, he was like, oh, okay, when you put it that way. And that was it. Dude. Stupid damage bonus that I'm not gonna get. Uh, I'm teasing. All right, we're gonna get a damage bonus in 36 seconds. Nice. All right, four seconds for the parking bonus. I could probably do better if like, I just actually put any amount of effort whatsoever into parking. It's a car waiting to be serviced. I liked my valet buddies better when they were just jogging in place. Oh, there, I guess there still is one guy who's still doing that. All right, let's just chill for a sec. There's gonna come some more vehicles soon. I hope, yep, there's one. A lot of people that need to have their cars parked here. Oh, that's a lot of, that's a big family, dude, dang. Car waiting to be serviced, here we go. So let me ask you guys a question. Can you do, do you have to do all five in one go? Or are they cumulative as well? Okay, parking bonus was much better that time. Much better. All right, we got one more car to park too. All right, anyway. I think people think Rockstar will never re release GTA 6. Yeah, I'm, I mean, well they said they came out on social media and said they were making another Grand Theft Auto game. So I don't know why anyone would think that anymore. I mean, I, I understood, I understand thinking that at one point, but I always just assumed they were just taking their time, trying to make it good, working on other stuff. Now they put so much time into GTA Online, they probably don't want to uh, put the effort into anything else that much. Park five cars. In two minutes. All right, so it's like one more car each time, basically. Car waiting to be serviced. Let's do it. No! No! Mine! What happens if I kill my valet brothers? Does it, uh, does it, does it help increase my, my ability any, at all? <laughs> Excuse me, sir. All right, hold up. Nice. All right, that's plenty of time. Let's keep going. Uh, da, da, da. Only Rockstar can get me hyped for a teaser trailer. For a trailer. Yeah, I'd believe it, man. I'm Shadow, says hello. What's up, Shadow? Welcome to the stream, dude. We're doing some good old Grand Theft Auto San Andreas. Definitive edition. The valet just avoided getting hit. He used the no clip cheat. Sounds about right, just like in Doom. Oh man, all right. Back here, here we go. Nice, all right, that actually worked out pretty good. Also, I'm not sure if you know, but you need to learn gym moves at each gym for 100%. Oh, I didn't know that, Lily, thank you for the information. Yeah, like the boxing guy, right? I didn't even think about that. I didn't even think about there'd be like different moves at a different station. Or a different gym, excuse me. So, okay, so I guess later when we're done with this mission, we'll go to the gym and we'll box with that guy, learn some new stuff. Cash, you can come back and do it later. Okay, good, so it's not all cumulative then. Or no, 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 it is cumulative is what I meant to say. You don't have to do all five in one go. That's good to know, because I didn't actually, I wasn't actually sure. There's only five levels though, so we can knock this out in one go pretty easily, I'm, I think. All right, parking bonus is six seconds. Yeah, I didn't put as much effort into it that time, unfortunately. If you kill them, you get some time subtracted. Oh, 
Okay, so that's that's not something I should do then. How unfortunate. I am gonna take this one though. Other guys lying down on the job, son. Let's go. I really want to run that little guy over so much, but I'm not going to. I'm gonna restrain myself. There we go. That is a bonus, ladies and gentlemen. That's what a proper bonus looks like. Guess if you kill them, you'll fail it. Mm. Let's not do that then. Robo Weissen says, Doom. Huge fan of Doom. Are you now? Well, you are in the right place, sir, because not only do I play si Oh, he just drove straight through that guy. That was whack. Not only do I play uh, the Grand Theft Auto games, I'm currently going through all the Doom games as well. I even did Maximum Doom, which took 14 months. Oh, man. Jack says, Cass, okay, let me tell you that if you were a businessman, you told Rockstar your employees to put time and quality in games, or would you rush them to make a game? Of course I wouldn't rush them to make a game. Unless it was just the only reason. Valley Mission Level 4, okay. Oh, it's dark. Oh, it's just because it's night, idiot. Uh, anyway, no, the only reason I would ever rush somebody was if it was just an emergency, right? Like, we either had to get it out or we're going to close our doors tomorrow. And I don't think that that applies in Rockstar's case ever. Dang nabbit. And the valet picked up the waiting car because a bloody course he did. All right, here we go. You know, you're excused. Let me take your car. Greedy fella. Okay. Cars to park six. So this is level four, guys. So we got this level and then one more after it. We're, we'll be done with valet. What a cool little, like, side job to do, right? I mean, you know, we've done several. We've been a fireman and a, you know, a taxi driver and we've delivered food. But this is, this is different. This is kind of cool. GTA San Andreas is a big game and you can forget about things very easily as it turns out. Oh, man. Um, Robo Weissen says, want to play the newer Doob games at some point? Yes, you and me both. I also want to play the newer ones. Uh, currently, I'm on Doom 64. And after, I think that's like the last Doom game that's like the classic 2D games. I mean, obviously, there's still plenty of Doom mods to go through. If you look down below in the description, guys, you'll see like a link uh, to a Google Drive folder which has a bunch of PDFs in it of uh, games that I'm planning to cover on the channel in the future and do series on. Dang, Nabbit, I totally screwed this up. Oh, well. Um, and anyway. So, it's got a whole bunch of games on there, and I have one list alone just for Doom mods, and there's so many of them. Regardless, though, uh, after Doom 64, I'll be starting to move into the newer Doom games. You got Doom 3... You got the mobile Doom games, and then you got Doom 2016, which is really what it's all about. So, that's going to be cool. Old man with hot chicks. Yeah, I know, right? <clears throat> when will we get the Red Dead Redemption series cast, or you don't know yet? I don't know yet, dude. Have no idea. We'll get it at some point, because we'll branch out and play other Rockstar games eventually. But as far as, like, when is it going to happen, I, I have no idea. It, it won't be till we do many other things first. Uh, I first found your channel when you did a review of Project Brutality. Oh, really? Oh, that's cool, dude. I didn't know that. That's awesome. I need to do an, a, uh, an updated review. Um, sometime soon. Because it's been a while since I've done that, and the game has gone through several changes. I did that for version, like, 3.0. And they're on, like, what? 3.2 or 3.4 or something ridiculous now? And it was poorly optimized back then, but I've heard there's been a lot of good fixes. Do people get paid that much for parking cars? Oconda, I can answer that with a definitive yes. If you're in the right place, like in a, a larger city and you're doing this, you absolutely can. I had a, uh, a friend of mine, right? When he was about my age, he worked as a valet in a larger town just south of here, and he always got paid really good. And he met some cute women too, so... Mega that what you will. GTA 4 is better music than 5. Is that so, KJ1? Alright, it's improved quite a bit with its weapons since you played it. Yeah, I, I believe it. I'm sure it has. Hold up. There you go. That was, that was a decent parking job. I can't lie. <laughs> Alright, two more cars to go, guys. Da, 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 da. Lily says majorly disagree. Oh, fun. Okay, still need to become a pimp for 100%. Yeah, I, I keep forgetting about that. 
Sam, what I need to do is find one of the cars, one of the vehicles you need for that, and stick it in a garage for later. So I'd have it ready to do that side activity. All right, let's grab this. Ow, wake up. Maximum Matt, welcome. He says, what's up, Sir Cassington? Long time no see, buddy. It's good to have you here. Hope you're having a good one. Hey, you should check out the funny moments montage I made the other day, dude. You got a, you had a, you had a slight, a slight cameo in there, in a manner of speaking. Speaking of Doom mods, I'm currently going through Alien Vendetta, and it's a chef's kiss of a wand, sir. Really? That's awesome, dude. I need to play Alien Vendetta at some point. Midnight Club isn't hard, says Sam. You don't think anything is hard, though, Sam. I mean, come on now. There we go. I beat you to it, dummy. Get destroyed. All right, guys. Last car. Last automobile. Well, he says, I don't like any of the radios in GTA 4. Not my kind of music, but 5 has a pop and a sort of... Uh, a sort of classic rock station. Okay. I guess that makes sense. I haven't I haven't played either one of them enough to, to say one way or the other which has a good radio. I'm sure I'll be very opinionated about that in the future. If you guys are curious which radio I like so far, I would have to rank... Here's how I would rank the radios in Grand Theft Auto, okay? San Andreas at the top, Vice City slightly under it, GTA 3 way down underneath it, and then slightly below 3, uh, 1, and then below 1, 2. That's how I would rank it. Oh, man. Can't wait till you do Fallout. Oh, funny thing, Psycho Monkey. Uh, originally, I put out a poll on whether to do a Doom or a Fallout series, and Doom actually won. But I still will do Fallout at some point. So... It's just, it's a matter, you have, you gentlemen have to understand. It is a matter of having so many good games and simply not enough time. So, but hey, that's okay. <laughs> Midnight Club is good, but it makes me rage so often. Yeah. Well, he says, Midnight Club 3 Tokyo Challenge is not easy. Hmm. Robo Weissen says, Alien Vendetta. I'm planning to play it after I finish Lost Civilization. Nice, man. I'm still playing Sunder, and those maps are incredibly painful. Wow. Dang, dude. Uh, Kess, don't worry about getting a pimp car because you get one from main missions. Oh, okay. I didn't realize that, Sim. I'll just wait till we get one then. And then we'll do that side activity. Robo Weissen, I don't know if you've played Golden Souls, dude, but that is a really good Doom mod to check out. And so is Wolfenstein Blade of Agony. I don't know how much you like total conversions because, I mean, at that point, it's almost sort of not Doom anymore. But it's, I don't know. For what it is, it's pretty fun. So... But I guess that's kind of diff. Well, no, no, I take that back. Wolfenstein Blade of Agony is more like a Wolfenstein game than a Doom game. But um, at least the first Golden Souls, even though it's technically a total conversion, even even really the second one, they still play like Doom. You know what I mean? So I don't know. Anyway, uh, do you know how a man was fired in just a few minutes because his daughter made a video review about the new iPhone? And her father got fired from the Apple's company and was paid well. Well, that's a shame. Probably some, uh, some non-disclosure agreement, I'm guessing. That's unfortunate, though. I bet he was upset. Anyway, Logic the Abdos is hello. What's up, Logic? Welcome to the stream, dude. Okay, Travis says, I totally agree. It's hard as hell. Midnight Club 3. Hey, hey, you gotta pick up the slack, dude. You gotta pick up the slack, buddy. I'm over here. I'm over here on that grind, son. All right, we got six more cars to do, guys, and then we will be done with Valet. We spent a lot of time working on this. Yeah, it's going to pay off, though. Just you wait and see. Maximum Matt says, isn't every map a slaughter map in Sunder? Mm. What? Oh, yeah, I'm actually playing Blade of Agony right now. Oh, really? Awesome, dude. It's so good. It's like my favorite Doom mod I've played to date. So, and I still need to go back and replay it because they updated to 3.1. I played 3.0 when it came out. But then they released 3.1, which is the Achievements Edition. And it's like, Achievements, really? I've totally got to play that again and get the Achievements. I'm a completionist, dang nabbit. You can have custom music in GTA 5. Didn't know that. I could never get it to work, but yeah, supposedly you can. Oh, uh, man, I have a game for you from Novel Logic called Delta Force Series. I think I actually have a Delta Force game on disc in my room, if I'm not mistaken. Because that name sounds familiar. I'll check out Golden Souls. You totally should, dude. It's really good. There's Golden Souls 1 and 2. And there's a trailer, or not a trailer, a demo 
for the third one, which I'm going to be playing myself after I uh, finish Golden Souls 2. How do you even, what do you even do to have custom music? I don't know. It's, there's like guides and stuff on how to do it, but I don't remember exactly how it works. Because like I said, I can never figure out how to get it going. Oh, man. All right, guys. So, what's next? Bring me another car, son. Bring me another car. Yes, yeah, Thunder Maps are very slaughtery. Nice. Reason why I don't think Midnight Club is hard is because I'm good at driving a game except for NASCAR games. Oh, I see. I see. You're just, you're saying you're good at driving in games, period. So, and that's how you get around the difficulty. Okay. Fair enough, dude. Fair enough. All right. 12 and 45 seconds. We got plenty of time. All right. Only on map 06 and it's more harder than all of Ultimate Doom and Doom 2 combined. That does sound difficult. I play a lot of driving games and Midnight Club is the hardest in my opinion. Hmm. Okay. Well, I guess I'll just have to make up my mind when I play it for myself. So, Cash, you've played GTA 5 before. I've started it, um, before, but I never finished it. Same with GTA 4 years ago, you know, before I actually started doing YouTube. Um, and the reason why is because I decided I wanted to go back and play the old ones first and like play them in order of release So that's why I never finished it same with GTA online, right? I started I played a little bit with my brother, you know Because he likes to play it, but uh, I haven't actually like properly Started it, you know So uh, so yeah Anyway, let's go pick this up. Oh Nobody's got it yet mine all right, we got two more cars, guys, and we'll be good to go. It's party time, apparently. News to me, but here we are. <laughs> nice. All right, guys, one more car to go. You need to have at least three MP3 files in order for GTA 5 custom radio to work. Really, KJ1? Ah, oh, that explains it. I never put in three. I never once did that. I only put in, like, two. Well, I'm an idiot. That explains why I could never get it to work. Eh. Maybe not all of Doom 2, but definitely all of Ultimate Doom. Okay, then. Maximum Matt says, okay, you've sold me. I'm playing it now. Nice. I'm playing it, too. At some point. <laughs> right now, I'm too busy with Golden Souls. Which, by the way, tomorrow we're doing Golden Souls 2, and we will most likely be finishing these. So, be sure and tune in for that, because it's going to be a fun... Uh, a very fun, very long stream. Asset acquired. Let's go, son. Beautiful. So we now own this building. This property will now generate revenue up to a maximum of 2000 Make sure you collect it regularly. All right, guys. Valet parking complete. Good stuff. So we got ourselves another asset here. I didn't really realize this was like an asset mission, but it's still cool. I don't play GTA Online. Oh, okay. Well, after I play, uh, after I do my GTA 5 series... I'm going to start one on GTA Online, and it's going to be awesome because we're uh, going to be doing, we're going to be completing it, right? Going to be playing with viewers. It's going to be super cool. So anyway, uh, later maps Thunder take hours to complete. Wow. There's some Wolfenstein levels which take like an hour each to complete. Or I'm sorry, not Wolfenstein. Wolfenstein Blade of Agony. All right, let's go ahead and go back to our house real quick and save. And we will start on our next mission. Cast 2 isn't the magic number. 3 is. Apparently, yeah. GT Online has gotten so boring. Really, Willie? How come? Is it just not fresh enough anymore? Or are they just not add enough stuff? Is there too much stuff? Or what is it? You can only pick one. Half-Life 3 or GTA 6? Well, I haven't played Half-Life, so that's not really fair for me to pick that. Jack's like, I'd take Half-Life 3. Honestly, even as a GTA fan, I think I would too. Because, you know, right now GTA 6 is already confirmed. Half-Life 3 is still kind of up in the air. <laughs> All right. Herbal Weissen says, yay, Doom, my favorite. Yeah, it's going to be fun. Your mom's a go golden soul. Oh, oh. You're, you're probably right about that, Matt. Uh, anyway, uh, that's why I don't play GTA Online. It's boring as hell. Really? Huh. Okay. So, so if I start a series, so just to clarify, if I start a series on it, you guys aren't going to play it with me, right? 
So that's how a business works. Work a few days of valet and own the building. Exactly, Doc. It's America, son. Anyone can move up the ladder. <laughs> I couldn't resist. I don't blame you, dude. That was brilliant. Oh, man. Remember the gym cast. I forgot about the gym, Lily. Uh, did I save? I did not. All right. So, now that I've saved, let's go to the gym, pump some iron, and then... Not really. We're going to learn some new moves. And then we're going to come back here and do another CJ mission. We're all waiting for Half-Life 3? Yeah. Even the people like me who haven't played it are waiting for it. Hey, at least they're making Half-Life games again, right? I mean, the last one was a VR game, but still... Actually, wasn't there like a bug, or not a bug, an easter egg in that that supposedly confirmed Half-Life 3? I don't know, I'll have to play it eventually. At some point, I'm going to stream Half-Life on the channel. That'll be fun. Well, uh, when you've been playing it for nine years straight, doing the same thing over and over is just so tedious and bleh. I, I, I understand that, Lily. I don't blame you. I can I can see why that would grow, grow old. All right, nothing like a game having good character moth having good characters mafia friends truly unique quality <laughs> Okay, KJ one. Oh, you're saying that because of Jack Eugen's comment. I see now GTA 4 for me still the best GTA Why the story it's dark and depressed and with the good characters mafia friends <laughs> And then KJ one's making fun of him. He says that's like a game having good characters mafia friends Oh my gosh. Oh, I'm gonna play it with you, Wall. Good. Good, Willie. Got that T Squad Plus. Yeah, you do. Cast favorite game of all time. Mine is Shinmu. Favorite game of all time. I don't know if I could pick just one, Psycho Monkey. People ask me that all the time, but I don't know. I don't know. I can tell you what game I put the most time into. That's Team Fortress 2. KJ1 says, I am going to play GT Online if you stream it and need viewers' help. All right. Well, good, KJ1. I appreciate that. Yeah, we'll play with you. Okay, good. Good. I'm happy to hear that. I'd be down to play GTA Online with you. Okay, so so the message I'm getting is even though you guys hate GTA Online and it's boring and it sucks, you still will play it with me. I'm very happy to hear that because I was, I was going to be disappointed. You should get Katie while you're there. Katie. Katie? Katie. There's a Katie at the gym? Hey, hey, which one of you chicks is Katie? These are all dudes, so I'm guessing none of them. Uh, oh, this is like one of those Taekwondo gems. Oh, what the hell? Oh, that's cool. So Hold up. Wish to become a warrior. A little bit, yeah. <laughs> oh, well, like Katie isn't there. She's at the car school, and you can't get into the car school until the phone call. Oh, no, she's at the park next to the gym. Oh, the park next to the gym. Okay, I'll go to the park and check after we're done becoming a warrior. Defeat your opponent to learn new moves. If you leave the ring, you lose. You left the ring and forfeited. I got booted out of it. What do you mean I forfeited? All right, hold up. I'm, I'm doing this again. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I wish to become a warrior. Get destroyed. Yeah, who's going on the ring now, son? Be your opponent to learn new moves. Boom. This guy's crazy. Ooh. With the eyes, young student, and you will learn. Running attack. Wall running, hold. Right click and press left click. Oh, to do that big kick? That's kind of cool. Ground attack. Attack a downed opponent by holding right click and pressing left click. Oh, okay. I think I've done that before. Combo attack, or not. No, I couldn't have done it before. We just now unlocked it. Hold right click and do left click for a swing attack. Okay. New moves learned. That was just, like stupid easy. That was awesome. All right, let's go over here to the park to meet what's her face. All right, anyway, uh, Katie, so you can keep your guns when you die. She needs high appeal, but if you get the banshee next to the gym, it should be fine. Oh, okay. Hold up. Oh, I see her. Banshee next to the gym. Ban wait. Banshee next to the gym. What the hell? There's a banshee? This isn't what she meant, right? No. A banshee next to the gym. What banshee? Well, I don't see a banshee. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh, oh wait, sorry. Well, like I said, it's a big game. It is. It is a big game. Oh dang, what a fast defeat. I know, right? Well, kicked out of the ring, literally. Saul Goodman yelling at traffic and gaining temperament on his way 
to vouch for Walter and Jesse. Yeah, I know, right, Alex? <laughs> Good having you on the stream, dude. Alpha says, even though in from an objective standpoint, GT Online sucks, it's still really fun. I could see that. Cass, I was talking about Michelle, but Lloyd was talking about Katie. There's three girlfriends you can get now. One in Blueberry and one in the park and one in the car school. Okay. It didn't spawn in. It's in the alley. It usually spawns right next to the gym. Okay. Uh, hmm. All right. Well, I'll tell you what. Let's try. Let's try grabbing this and seeing if it's good enough. Get out the oh, wait a minute. Wait. Wait a minute. What's this other car? This looks fancy. Why don't you use this instead? You can have it back, dude. I don't give a crap. Hold up. What about this? The man is watching you. The man is watching me, huh? Hey, another druggie. This is a clover. What do? Excuse me, miss. Can I have your attention? Katie's a cute one. What's up, girl? Hey, I'm Katie. You wanna go out sometime? Yes. Yeah, call me soon. Sweet. Oh, what the crap? Oh great, I'll call you later. Yeah, no problem, girl. Really? Really, dude? Katie is your girlfriend now. She'll get you out of the hospital for free. You can pick her up on dates at her place. Man, you really can't you really can't fight against a gun, can you? <laughs> hey Katie, can you get me out of the hospital for free, sweetheart? Apparently not. Katie, what'd you do to the ambulances? No, I don't care! this one slide, man. Got too much shit on my What did Katie do to the ambulances, guys? Check it. Okay, I don't think I want to go out with her anymore. No. No. Is this like is this like some creepy way of saying I love you? No, no. I, I think this relationship is over before it even started. Oh man. Doc says, wait, you said that car was fancy. Uh, Doc, I don't want to hear it. I don't want to hear it. Kess picks the worst car in the game. Ah, uh, yes. Rusty car with mismatched paint equals fancy. <laughs> uh, Alex says, sorry, I just realized I was an hour and 40 minutes behind. Oh, no problem, Alex. Uh, well, was Kay doing yoga just then? I don't know what the hell she's doing. I thought Kay's just standing there as an innocent man is getting shot at. Those ambulances are having too much fun. Getting killed after a meet cute is probably not the best way to start a relationship. Probably not. She gives you a cool outfit at 100%. Oh, that's nice. What's, wait a minute. So does, uh, so does Denise, actually. <laughs> um. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, yeah. Don't think she's nice. She's crazy. Talk about car. Yeah, right? Ambulance maybe may Yeah, nah. Yeah. Hmm. All right. Sad part is that the ambulance glitch was even in the original Xbox version. Yet everyone will blame the Definitive Edition. Oh. Uh, how can you blame them when the Definitive Edition is really buggy? All right. Well, you know what? I could do another uh, CJ mission. And I will. But first, let's go pick up good old Katie. And go on a date. Because why not, right? All right. Hey, don't kill her. I'm not killing her, dude. I'm going, I'm going to go take her on a date. Cass, and that's how ambulances are made. <laughs> pa apparently it is. Apparently that's how ambulances are made, Sam. You know, when two ambulances love one another very much. No. No. All right, Cass, I'll be going to eat for a bit. Have you a good food or a good eating sesh or whatever the hell you do, man. I'm teasing. See you later. Have a good one. Rebel Weiss and see you at the top. I always said wrong account. Whoops. Hey, Willie, help a brother out. How does, how does, how do you, how do you actually date? She's not home right now. Okay. I'll come by when it's not so early in the morning. Um, how do you how do you date Katie? Like, what is she like? I don't know anything about her. We we literally just met. I guess I'll go do an, a mission for now. Oh man, uh, Cash, you know what? The best character will be good in GTA 6. I'll tell you the ask the actor's name, Joe Pesky. What does that have to do with GTA 6? Katie should look up. To what happened to Denise before dating CJ? <laughs> Doc, that was just an accident at sea, dude. I can't be blamed for that. Yeah, why? Yep, why not? A nice date. What could go wrong? Exactly. You better not be cheating on me, Cascarte. Denise, you're dead. Shut up. 
Cash, you gotta be there at night. Ah, okay. KJ1 said the same thing. You're dead. Oh my goodness. Wait a minute. Wait. 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 Oh, it's a wrecking ball. Oh. Oh, I, I genuinely didn't know what was up in the sky there. I was confused. Oh, there's a chainsaw up there, too. That's cool. All right, guys. Let's go pick up some weapons real quick. Uh, since we died. And we'll do another mission. And maybe take our girl Katie out on a date. All right. Cashew left slow drives and directs eating behind her house at the burger place. Oh, okay. Good to know, Sam. Thank you. All right. Food date. She likes the place right behind her house. Right, right. Also very much like Denise, funny enough, because she liked the bar right behind her house. What's it with women and liking places that are familiar? Eric Behel says, hey, what's up, Eric? Welcome to the stream, dude. Doing some good old Grand Theft Auto San Andreas. Hey, homies. What up, Carl? What the fuck is going on? Do I look like a hooker to you? What? Those assholes keep saying shit to me. Who said this to you? Fucking structure workers up that hill. I'm going to fuck them up. Nah, hold up. I got this. I need to go teach him a little respect, huh? That's right. Yeah. I bet Let's do it. Me some new land anyway. Yeah. Let's go, son. Let's knock over some construction workers. All right. Uh, scare off the construction firm. Destroy all the portables and kill the foreman. All right. Sounds easy enough. Construction machinery will help destroy portables. Oh, portables. They're talking about the toilets or the buildings or something. Just draw the portables. You'll need a bulldozer. I don't know if they're talking about the little, uh, the little buildings or the toilets. I think they're talking about the toilets. Oh, it smells terrible. Oh, goodness. That needs to be destroyed. Hold up. Yeah, that's what it means. It means the toilets and kill the foreman. Easy enough. Boom. Be careful to avoid explosive barrels. Will do. Hey, you know what? They shouldn't have been so rude to my sister. They should have stopped. I said please. Nice. Boom. Get destroyed. Explosive barrels, huh? Is that going to be a problem? Uh, what else? Oh, maybe I am supposed to destroy the... Maybe it's not about the toilets. Eh, no, I don't think it has anything to do with the uh, toilets at all, actually. Like you can't jack me. No, really? Is that what we're doing? Do all right, I'll tell you what we're going to do. Oh, yeah. Hold up. Nice. All right, let's try that again. Hold up. Hold up. Let's try. Okay. What is it I'm supposed to be destroying to get home up? I'm already confused. I thought it was the toilets we were supposed to get. Oh, you're too kind. You destroy the houses, the portable buildings. Okay, my bad, guys. My bad. I was confused. All right, let's back it up real quick. Dude, oh, this thing is so slow. It's so hard to get. Oh, crud, there's another one. Hold up. Oh, he's trying to, he's trying to run me over now. Stupid construction workers. Oh, there's a fire truck over there. Wow. Takes a lot of bullets to kill that guy. Gosh. Get run over, son. All right. Destroy the buildings. Boom. There you go. Five portables left. Okay. I clearly did not understand the purpose of that very well, did I? Oh, man. Could CJ go swinging on the wrecking ball asking for a friend? This is your favorite mission, Eric. <laughs> Swinging on the wrecking ball. Uh, CJ and another Miley Cyrus, apparently. All right, hold up. We got to go get this other... We got to go get this other uh, thingamajig. Get out of here, you stupid construction worker with the shovel. Hold up, guys. Nice. Get destroyed, fool. All right, now people are screaming because guns. All right, we got 40 seconds. Let's go. This bulldozer is way too darn slow. There's a fire truck again. Bye-bye, fire truck. See ya. Wouldn't want to be ya. Nice. There we go. Mmm. The fried curry guy. That was the foreman. Who 
Holy crap, I didn't see nothing. <laughs> oh, this should be fun. Push the mobile toilet in the ditch. <gasps> then bury him under concrete? Dude, that is brutal. Oh, okay. You insist. <laughs> bury the foreman in his toilet. <laughs> I love this game so much. Oh my gosh. No! No, 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 no. No, hold up. All right, at least the timer's gone now, so that's nice. All right, here we go, guys. Who's shooting at me, I wonder? I don't even know. Oh, God, no! Eh. Oh, God. Oh, I'm gonna blow. I'm sure you are, dude. Hold up. Oh, my God. It's, it's gone. Yeah, that's really what your primary concern should be right now. All right, hold up. We got a shotgun here. Crap. Oh, these guys got guns now. That's unfortunate. All right, I'm out. Let's go. Quickly. Before they come after me anymore. Back in position in front of the hole. Will do, son. All right, there we go. There we go, son. Bye bye. That's one way to do it. All right, GG, mission passed, baby. That worked out pretty good, guys. Can't lie. Uh, what's this new thing? Ooh. That's a weird looking little symbol. Look at that weird little red dragon symbol. I wonder what mission that's gonna end up being. I genuinely have no idea. Eh, get destroyed. All right, let's save real quick. Make a new save right here. There we go. Oh, who's calling me now? Well, I was talking to Caesar and uh, don't get me wrong, dude. I mean, you are one out there dude when it comes to driving, man. But Caesar, he told uh -huh. how many cars you get through, dude. And me <laughs> and Dwayne were like, whoa. What is your point, Jethro? No, no point, man. No point. Just that there's an advanced driving school, like, just up the road from the garage, man. Like in Doherty. Driving school? Man, exactly what you trying to say, man. Nothing, man. Nothing. It was Dwayne's idea. I think you're, you know, cool and shit. Uh -huh. Okay, guys, so there's a driving school to do next, which we're totally gonna do. But first, let's go up here and take Katie on a date real quick. And we're gonna we're going to uh, take her around in the most uh, fanciest of date vehicles, a taxi cab, which I apparently now have a wanted level for stealing. That isn't that's not fun. All right, this game is the best. It's pretty cool, Eric. I'm really having a fun time with it. It's pretty sweet. It'd be a funny way to scare a construction firm off. Yo, we destroyed all our toilets. <laughs> Where are we gonna go to the bathroom? It made sense in my head, dude. Oh, man. It's so dark, lol. I know, right? Man, dude gets killed and he's probably in the toilet. When his men hassled CJ's sister. Hey, he, sh he should have been paying more attention. No pity. No pity here. Dark but funny. Dark humor. Yep. All right. Like I said before, Cass loves going off hills and cliffs. That's the most mean-spirited mission in GTA history. No, nope. no, it isn't KJ1. That's not even close to the most mean-spirited mission. Are you forgetting Grand Theft Auto 2? You forgetting the hot dog mission? Come on now. Oh man. Psycho Monkey says that's a bit extreme. No, I, I'm telling you guys, compared, compared to the, uh, to the what's it called? Your girlfriend is not home right now. When the stink is she home? She's not home at 11 in the morning. She's not home at three in the morning. Like, is she ever home? It seems like optimal times to be home. All right, anyway. Cash, you can now see your girlfriend. Apparently I can't. Apparently she's not home at 3.30 in the morning. Got somewhere better to be. Do the driving school and get all gold medals. It's easy. <laughs> I will. I will. Eventually. I don't think it's going to be easy, though. <laughs> uh, all right. 
Guess you gotta pass all the car schools to unlock the car show room. Oh, okay. Good deal. Getting all gold on driving school is kind of hard, in my opinion. All right, we totally will still at least make an effort at it. At least it's easy in Definitive Edition. Yeah, I imagine it'd be a lot easier in uh, Definitive Edition than it would in the original. Sam says, so you're gonna do all the school missions and wait until Act 3. Oh wait, he says you gotta do all the school missions and then wait until Act 3 or 4, and that's when the, the car dealership comes up. That's cool. Oh snap, she's out with someone else, apparently. Little hurt, to be honest with you guys. 25 likes, that's crazy. All right, think it's act four, okay. So, uh, remember the hot dog homicide? I bet you do, dude. Grogu. Yeah, Grogu, that's your name. Cash, you, you got to see her between 1500 and midnight. What weirdly times, what odd times to be available, but all right, sure. Wait a minute, do I have a safe house closer to her house? I should have just done that, hold up. Oh, we're gonna go save, we're gonna turn around and go save over here. That's what we're gonna do. All right, isn't she a doctor? She probably has less free time then. Oh, she's a doctor. That explains it. Yeah, doctors work weird hours. Makes sense, Denise was usually available. She didn't do squat. Anyway, maybe she works at some manufacturing company from like 5 a.m. to 11 at night. Let's hope not. Be in a bad, she'd be cranky when I take her out if that was the case. Oh man, yeah, she's a paramedic or something. Oh, okay, and, and we have something to talk about now. I, I very briefly worked as a paramedic. You guys remember? I was in an ambulance and I went around and picked people up. It was great. All right, let's go ahead and go up here. Our new, uh, our new um, apartment we bought prior. There we go. Alrighty, guys, let's go ahead and hop in here real quick. Take a little nap, and we'll go take out our girl. No dates. Oh, that's okay, man. Here, we're just gonna take a little nap, and I'm sure she'll be ready to go then. Uh, hold up. What time is it now? It is 1200. I'll tell you what. Let's go take a nap again. The car door is just opening and closing over and over again for the hell of it. Still doing it. Crazy. <laughs> to be fair, the last time Katie saw you, you died. So she moved on. Ugh! Not very nice. She could have at least given me a chance to come back from the dead first. You know, come on. Have a little self-respect. Oh, man. Hot dog homicide was a gross mission. Yeah, a little bit. Guess she's a nurse. Ah, okay. Well, Regardless, at least we both have worked in the medical industry. That at least gives us some common ground. You gotta think of these things. It's important when you're going on dates with women is to think of the common ground to discuss, right? You, you have to. It's imperative. I'll stink. Ah, I tried. Ah, you know what? Screw this. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna run over to her house. In the rain. Cause that's totally romantic, right? For some reason. Yeah, getting wet is romantic. Oh, there's her car, she's home. What's good, Katie? I'm gonna take your car, I hope. Hey, Clark. Oh, she's cute. Hey, gorgeous. Okay, What's up? Like Pick a place your girl might like and take her there. Choose between fast food restaurant, bar, or diner, as indicated by the map. You guys said she liked to eat at the burger place behind her house, but there's a frozen yogurt place behind her house. Did you mean down here? At this place? I'm gonna, gonna try this, because this is technically behind her house. Yeah, I love how I jacked the car and she doesn't care. She's like, oh, okay, no problem, I'll get in. Uh, you know what, though? I'm gonna drive the other way. I'm gonna drive, I'm gonna drive safely if we're gonna go on a date. Oh, there's that bridge that's closed off again. Yeah. Here we go. This is where we want to be. All right, can you imagine if we all took naps? You abandon your girlfriend, the date is over? How did I abandon her? Progress with Katie declined? Hold up, hold up. Let's reload from our save here, because I don't know what this thing happened. I was simply driving to get some grub. What more was I supposed to do? Yeah, let's, tr let's try that one more time. 
Alright. Anyway. Uh, there's a joke in there somewhere, which I won't say, but Rockstar being sneaky with stereotypes. Oh. Uh, <laughs> Can't she drive slow and eat out behind her house? Yeah, that's romantic. Um, sounds great to me. I don't know why she bailed on me. The yogurt place. Yeah, okay. Alright, good deal. We'll go check out the yogurt place here. Some people want to be exploited. The fact she has a hearse is a little fluffed up. A little bit. Uh, what, yeah, a hearse, that is a little odd, but you guys said she worked in the medical industry, so I guess it makes sense. I, I don't know, I'm not one to judge. Maybe she just got a good deal on it, you know? It happens. Oh, apparently I already had someone in my car. Well, hey, I didn't actually see you the whole drive over here, but do you want to go on a date? Maybe just a little bit, no? All right, we'll try not to get wet, ha <laughs> ha. All right, here we go. She wasn't in the car. Oh. Oh, I see. I'm a moron. That explains it. Okay. Yeah. It's your date. I'm just there for fun. What does that even mean? All right. So she's in the car this time, at least. I must have not been playing it. I must have not been paying attention last time. Uh, hold on. Gant Bridge Visitor Center, gift shop, boring museum, and tourist information. That's funny. Even they're calling it boring. Diner slash restaurant. Cool. Let's eat, girl. Let's eat some food. What's wrong with her face? She looks like a doll, kinda. A little bit. Like so sm smooth and pale. She's even have a good time. Looks tired. You better take her home. All right. Strong arms, DJ. Uh, okay. Got even more thunderstormy by now, didn't it? Oh man, maybe she's a coroner roll. That would make sense. I saw her rolling in the ground as you pulled away from her house. Uh, I wasn't even paying attention, Doc. I thought she was in the car. I must just be an idiot. No wonder I got negative progress. I'm an incompetent boyfriend. I've been a nurse for three years now. Uh, oh, she's a nurse. Yeah. You guys are right. See you around, girl. Wants another date? Good deal. All right, guys. Brought a date to a date, baller. I know, right? How'd you lose her? She's in your. I don't know. I don't know, Sam. Apparently, somebody else saw her not be in the car. Oh man, it's never happened to me in the tens of thousands of hours that I've played this game. But you can run into your other girlfriends and they find out you're cheating. That's funny, Roy. <laughs> Look how they massacred Katie. I know, right? Oh man. All right, guys, let's go ahead and go back on home. We got driving school. We got the little red dragon ninja mission. Which one should we do first? I'm gonna assume driving school, probably. Oh, hey, at least we had a good date with Katie, right? I'll say that for us. Also, what's with the red? Oh, yeah, that's probably the car dealership that doesn't unlock till later, I'm assuming. All right, fair enough. So, businesses just work a little bit different in this somewhat. Doc755 says, gotta head out, cast fun stream as always. Catch you next time. Good deal, Doc. You have you a good one, buddy. I appreciate you being here. Well, he says, I bet he ends the stream. Well, I wasn't going to announce it till I went home, but yeah, you're right. I am ending the stream now. <laughs> so, because it's been about uh, three and a half hours, so we are going to call it here. So, yeah, but I wanted to go home and save. I like to go home and save and then say, okay, that's the end of the stream. Because then it's then it's it's proper, you know? It's the proper climactic end that way. So, yeah. Well, let's at least get some ammo and stuff. I still got a wanted level? Really, dude? Lame. All right, oh no, 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 not yet, not yet. All right, so, all right, now, now I'm ending the stream. So yeah, guys, that is the end, uh, or not, hey, apparently. Caesar, the yay leaving San Fiero, right? Right, but they're using bikes, CJ, and they go cross and they go country. Cross country. Yeah, we, we know, not right Caesar. Now. I gotta, I gotta check, check in with some stink. Uh. All right, guys, <laughs> so that is gonna be the end of this episode of San Andreas, the definitive edition, a rise to the top series. I hope you guys enjoyed Thank you very much for tuning in and for being a part of the stream this afternoon. It was super fun. When we come back next time, we're going to finish the trucking missions, at least as much as we can. We're going to go down here and do the driving school. We're going to do this weird, 
what is this even? This looks like a killer whale eating a, a, some peas in a pot. I don't know what the hell this is, but we're going to do that. We're going to take Katie out some more, do a whole bunch of stuff. It's coming up on the next episode. So yeah, so uh, we'll be back with this very, very soon. But thank you guys for being here. Thank you for 25 likes. And uh, thank you for just being a part of a cool community. Anyway, uh, we will be back tomorrow with some Doom the Golden Souls. We're going to be finishing that series tomorrow, Doom the Golden Souls 2. So if you want to see the grand finale for that, be sure and tune in. I'll set up a watch page sometime soon. And, uh, yeah, I think that's basically it for now. Thank you guys again for being here. I'm going to read the chat before I go. Cast the Red Dragon. The Red Dragon is the guy from the race that Claude was in. Oh, that guy. Yeah. Yeah, it happened to me once. Denise appeared in San Fierro and was tailing me by the valet area, and it never triggered ever again. It's incredibly rare. That's crazy. Figures Kess weaves it at a cliffhanger. I'm sorry, Sam. It just do be like that sometimes. Here, I'll tell you what. I'll go stand. I'll, hold up. Before we end the stream, I'll go over here and stay on the edge of the cliff, and then I'll literally be leaving on a cliffhanger. I'm teasing. I'm not doing that. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Oh, wow. All right. First do driving school, then end stream. No, driving school is going to take a while, KJ1, so we will save that for next time. Anyway, guys, thank you all again for being here. Until next time, I've been your host, Kess Gaming. I will see you all at the top.